Cheers Hello. Ah, hello. 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 <laughs> Firing from the <laughs> fucking hip. What'd you say, Momo? What the fuck did Nothing. you say? I didn't say anything. Okay. I didn't hear anything at all. Me neither. Okay. Haha. <laughs> okay. Holy shit, we're level nine. Tee hee hee Haha. Let's uh let's <laughs> let's dive on in. Uh Naomi, wanna grace us with a recap? Let's start this celebration with some fiddle. On the last episode, we leveled up. It Hold on, you said cool. you, you said fiddle? <laughs> yeah. I don't know what that means. <laughs> it's okay. It's just it's like a sixteen year old YouTube video that I quote all the time and nobody ever mm -hmm. knows what it is. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nice. I'm okay. so sorry, yep. but I'll, I'll send it in the chat so that like people Thank can, you. if if they want to. Um, it's so bad, but it's good, you know. Okay. Anyway, yeah. Anyway, um, yeah. So on the last episode, we leveled up and checked out some amazing fan art. Cheadle remarked on the parts and loot that we had acquired, and our barge fueled up, got moving once more. Marius showed Cheadle some photos from the station and told him about the evacuation and strange communication from the station. Child of Ganymede rang a bell with Cheadle. They realized that the brown planet we had a picture of was in fact Ganymede. The planet was recently discovered, and some Ionians were there, starting a few mining operations with great interest in its resources. We pondered what Ceratos' purpose might be, and looked at that irradiated blob out in space. Whatever this thing is, or was, and Hecaton too, was a threat. But so was the big dead space baby. So, Cheadle proposed that we actually not tell the Senate about the big space blob so that they'd be more likely to allocate resources to Asmodia. Persuaded by cheats, Cheadle hesitantly shared what the true threat we're facing off against is. The Senate. They've <laughs> proposed outlandish ways to deal with the shadows, forgetting about Asmodia, considering it lost, even going so far as to unchain it from Io in its entirety, to leave it to float in the vast abyss of space without any support or communication with the mainland that they belong to. After a bit of conversation, everyone was leaning towards keeping information about the irradiated threat from the Senate, because fuck those guys. I mean, wait, sorry, YouTube, bleep those guys. <laughs> yeah, it's been over a bit, we're good. We agreed, then got to some crafting. After a few days of traveling, we approached Claybury and Kathos. Unfortunately, it was glowing red, entirely covered in radiation. Ionian militia and people in rad suits swept the area as we flew over. There was absolutely no way they didn't know about the radiation threat and all that. It, it, was, it was pretty bad. It was pretty bad. So we redirected over to Llewindolin, where the Senate is located, because it was time to get some fucking answers. Let's go! All right. <laughs> Great recap. Thank you so Thank much, you. Naomi. You're, you're so welcome. You're so welcome. Uh, so looking at the map over here, um, I think you guys are looking at Kathos, correct? So Clayberry is about, well, as long as Lobos is, um, yeah. Clay, Clayberry is about located right over here. Um, it is sort of this, well, now it just looks like it had been completely irradiated. Buildings itself is covered in the, like the mass of slime and, and ooze that seems to be like just kind of like pouring off the buildings itself and it's giving off a very faint unusual glow you're kind of watching as people are around in sort of these giant radiation suits trying to clean up the city the best they can you kind of see these specialty shard ships kind of floating around uh pointing over um kind of pointing over trying to clean everything there is and uh, yeah just from every uh, what i can describe as orifice of clayberry uh seems to be covered in this red suspicious ooze so um with clayberry definitely being a, a bit of a hazard zone uh you're gonna head over to which i believe is up here to Lwendolin. yes uh Lwendolin is located over here oh. um give me one second I got a couple of areas we've got. Uh, so we got Llewendolin's over, up over here. Uh, the city of Zeros is down here. 
Uh, this is from all the other campaigns. Uh, da, da, da. Archmond is over here. And um, is it? Yes, Vashar. Vashar is over here. So uh, you guys are going to be traveling north uh, using bar the barge uh, and moving a little bit faster now that you are outside of the veil of influence that would normally impact um, the the barge itself. So you're able to move a little bit quicker than uh, as a normal shard ship would, but still uh, chugging around eight hours later, you will arrive at the capital of uh, Kathos and might as well be the capital of Io, the, uh, the city of Luendolin. All right. Let me go ahead and get this going. I also have to make sure your, uh, your camera zoomed in appropriately. Um, using credits that have been issued to the, um, the designation of the barge, you were able to successfully land over to the closest area. Um, that, to the Senate, as well as the Asmodian Embassy, uh, which would be the Wendelin Star uh, Seaport East. Welcome to Wendelin. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Wow. Holy shit. We're it's so a crop big. circle city. <laughs> yeah, this is, uh, this is... Oh. Definitely going <laughs> going to be a different feel than you're used to when it came to Asbodian Kolkirk, as all of the city around Kathos is just dense and filled with this urban population. Um, you arrive oh over in like this beautiful and decadent uh, star seaport. As the barge comes in, you kind of see um, Cheadle's going to go ahead and give a couple of designations over. You know what what the designation of the ship is what the purpose of the visit is and you guys are able to land uh you guys are able to land immediately um because you uh, because you are part of the asmodian hunters the shadow hunters uh the barge can stay here indefinitely without having to pay any port fees all of that is handled uh in the all that is handled by the uh, government expenditures and uh, the taxes the people pay. So, hell yeah. You guys would leave the Star Sea port. Uh, it's very reminiscent of a rather large airport of our modern time. So you kind of see like, you know, botanical gardens within the area and everything like that. And wow. uh, yeah, you would um, right now. One second. And uh, yeah, so you guys would arrive over at the Star Sea Port, and uh, and yeah, what would you like to do? I'm uh, loving um, the smooth jazz that's playing mm -hmm. right yeah. now. Oh, yeah, yes. right. Sexy. I feel like this is the first time that Vanya and Gareth have seen a city like this, right? Seen green plants. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Yeah. It's like his first yeah. time in a major city too. Um, I'm just curious for scale, like how how big is this entire map that we're seeing, like? Like, like what, like in comparison yeah. to like, is, it, is there a city of, of, of in North America that is like a good size comparison? Oh man, yeah. that's a great question. Um, hmm, I mean, we oh, do. God. Yeah. I don't, I don't know if I can be best answer that, but yeah, this is the measurement uh, oh. of, of everything. So that might give you a better, I don't, I'm not a meter person. I don't, I don't uh, speak that. It's yeah. really big. Yeah. Okay, this, where's the ruler? Hold on. It's, uh, it's a hundred and this is 150 mile. I think miles or meters. Is it meters. miles or meters? Meters. 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 Okay, if it's meters, mind. then it's not that big. Yeah. yeah. Right. Let's see. It's about, it's about. What's a meter? Two blocks for a meter. So hold meter on. Meter done. It's tell me how much water I used. 492 feet for 150 meters. So, and that it's also. Like that measurement on kilometers yeah that measurement might also be a little inaccurate it's it's a it's a large wow. it's a large city though because you, you know all of these are actual full fledged buildings you know what i mean so unfortunately i don't Saint have lewis huh looks like st <laughs> lewis there you go <laughs> there it is there it is okay, okay maybe better question how long would it take to walk from one side of the city to another st uh, lewis <laughs> Uh, it would, it would, it would probably, I'd probably say about eight hours time. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. 
Yeah. Like what normal walking speed, though, meter? right? Yeah, yeah, normal walking speed. Okay. That's pretty big. Yeah, that's big. Cool. I'd be fucking exhausted. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> well, fortunately, uh, as you guys would leave the Starsea port, there is many uh, free travel. Uh, for example, if you see these little trails over here, that is the shard monorail system that takes you around the city. It's like oh. it's like a it's like a it's like a bullet train too, so it it Damn. takes you around very quickly. The city has planning mm -hmm. and amenities. You yeah, I just want to look at this map and look at everything. <laughs> there's so much. Yep. <laughs> Wait, yeah, and then, and then there's so like. So we're checking out every store, this? right? Every shop and every <laughs> store in this the, map. The, the guilds. <laughs> oh, the guilds. The guilds. I feel like Gareth Gareth is seeing this inside of this spaceport and thinking like that, you know, the city's a little small, but it's definitely super glamorous. <laughs> you're like, in the starport. Yeah. <laughs> you're at the fucking <laughs> food court and you're just yeah. like <laughs> convenient I, food, you know. Yeah. Would I like be a... familiar with Kathos as uh, a whole? Well, yeah, because I mean you're uh you're for you're from Arkman, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, Arkman. Oh, I spent my I spent my younger years in Arkman. Yes, uh, this is a probably a more dense, well put together Arkman. I thought you had a shop in Kathos. Well, Kathos is the the Ark. Um, Arkman is the it's the, like, like the, the state city. versus the city. Correct. Okay, where's hi, your where's your where's your shop, Marius? I see shops here. I'm I'm gonna say it's in Arkman. <laughs> Nope. Oh, okay. I thought it was in. So, I mean, you could also. Okay, so. Well, it is in Kathos. This is is Lewindolin is... that yeah. is in Kathos. That is oh, correct. Oh, Lewindolin. Is... Yeah. I got yeah. it. Capital is... City Lewindolin. In, is... we're, in... we're, we're blocking the name. Yeah. yeah. St. Lewindolin. I got it. <laughs> yeah. Um, This, and I don't mind showing you this because you could literally grab a map and look at it. Uh, For example, Whoa. this is this is Arkmund. Mm. So, so okay, point to your shop right now. Point to it. Where's your shop? <laughs> <laughs> point to it right now. We're what doing we're, we're, we're doing background development now. Uh, is it this uh, alchemist right shop? That's where I live. Uh, I found shops. Where, you don't know where my uh, home is. One? Where would I even be able to set up a shop? It's where you live too. It's your house. You live there. We live in the sports <laughs> arena. <laughs> I mean, honest... I, bet, I guess it would be somewhere <laughs> near like the uh, the uh, artificer people. So you know, I'm I'm down to, I'm down to talk background. I'm I'm totally cool with that. Now that we finally mm -hmm. arrived at Kathos, right here, so cool. I love maps, right here. man. I love maps. Right here. <laughs> no. Right no. here. Uh -uh. This, no. This is where I sleep, winky face. <laughs> Wait, what is the house of rats? Oh shit! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, so yeah, this is Arkman. Uh, that the capital spire is the Arkman spire, where most of the power of Kathos comes from uh, through right, technology baby. advances from Arkman. Um, but as you see here, it's you know there's denser areas. But as you kind of look around, um, oh sorry, let me turn this down because Can we live on the finger. <laughs> yeah, I was just looking at that. I was oh, looking at the house of rats. Oh. That's where I want to live. The pleasure house. Okay. I'm looking at waste processing. That's where Gareth lives. So, Good yeah. luck. We are taking over. So, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I, I don't mind showing you guys around uh, Kathos if you guys are genuinely curious. I'm, I'm just changing themes yes. as we go along depending on what map we're looking at. This is Arkman's theme. So, as, uh, yeah. I mean, as you can see, this still has the same dense buildings um, as you guys saw over in uh, Lwendolin. Um, but there is a lot of more open area and there's actually a little bit of farmland uh, that kind of works as people can kind of go across and, and work from there. Uh, another place cheap would be interested in would be over here in Vashar. Uh, Vashar is the northern. Let me see real quick. Bo, bo, bo. Where, where? More what? sexy music. Mm hmm. I've been listening to this type of music all day. Mm hmm. Yeah, we're, go we're going down the, 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 the pipeline. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, here we go. 
Uh, north of Arkmend is going to be uh, Vashar. So Vashar mm. is. Oh, sorry, I got I got some tokens. I have to delete. I forgot to do it. Uh, so uh, Vashar <laughs> is where. Let me look at this. Here we go. Um, it's north of Arkmend. Um, it is kind of more. Uh, I, it's it's upscale slums is I guess is the best way I could describe it um, because if you head on north over this area you arrive at Scrap Town aka Junk Pile Junction aka I have it bored. aka Junk Island baby and you see there's little buildings over here kind of like built all around the uh, scrap piles and things like that um, great area to sal to get some salvage uh would be over and, and scrap town is visited often i would imagine by uh, uh folks from arkmund as you see here oh. the arkmund checkpoint and, and go over there so a lot this of this is my mom's old house before i got crushed it's crazy <laughs> <laughs> oh. marius did a lot of uh like pro bono work basically and he he would come into scrap town and uh bashar often to sort of do a little upkeep for people, basically make sure that their shit was still working. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. why he That's so crazy. <laughs> this used to be my house. That's so crazy. He <laughs> stashed my house and then he scrapped it. <laughs> yeah, they got all blown up and just gone now. Yeah. So, no. but we aren't uh, here to talk about Bashar. We're here to talk about the now. Uh, yeah. Which, which is Luendolin. So let me take you back there now. <laughs> so much maps for Naomi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like looking at all these. Like, I wonder where the poor quarter is. I wonder where the rich district is. <laughs> What's this? What's that? What's the rat house? What is the rat house? I need to know. What, what is, is the rat house? You're gonna have to go to the rat house and find out. No, no, it's not on this map though. It's in. It's in the. Um, uh, it's in Arkmid, which is on yeah. the other side of the fucking arc. Good luck. There's a, a hand reaches out and he pats Gareth on the back. Uh, while we're here in Wendelden, I can sort of lead us around. But should we need uh, accommodation further away, such as return the way, uh, we can go to Arkmid. My store should still be there. <laughs> store? <laughs> My I shop, didn't... so to speak. What, I didn't know you had a shop. Our house. It's not just a shop, you know. It, what, what about your cat? What about the cats? They're fine. Yeah, huh? He's hoping your automatic feeders haven't gone off the fritz. Gotta I don't imagine how mad they would be. Thank you very much. <laughs> She's like, stand step for a Hey, what do you mean by uh, accommodations? What? You, hmm? said, you mentioned accommodations. What do you mean by that? Well, I imagine we're going to be here petitioning the Senate for a while. Yeah, we're, we're going to stay in a hotel. They're not, a hotel? What? Yeah, they're not. Yeah, if we're seeking uh, if we're seeking an audience with the Senate, we normally stay in a, in a hotel. We're not going to be roaming the street. We have homeless. money for that. Do you mean a, a hostel? N no, a, a hotel. I don't have enough money for that. It, you don't have to. It's it's paid for by the by the Senate. Oh. Oh. What because else is paid for by the Senate? <laughs> your your food. Maybe the pleasure house. Food is paid for. I could pr honestly, I could probably, I could probably squeeze in the the pleasure house. That I, I would understand that. What? They cover Does the pleasure house have a lot well? of food in it? Yeah, absolutely. In a sense. Yes and yes. <laughs> Sorry, I'll say that. Vizika, Vizika, yeah. come yeah. look at this. Yeah. Gareth's like bewildered by like a bar, and there's like all these different bottles of different. It literally alcohols is and... like if you look up, just like an airport, like it's glass ceilings, so you can see the clear oh. skies and, and everything. Yeah. Wow. Oh, oh this is your uh, first. This is your first time off Asmodia, huh? So. It what is. what what, I mean, what are things covered in green? Like <laughs> what are things covered in? Oh, what is this? Ovanya. 
Oh, that's, this is gonna be fun. That's uh, that's uh. Are you uh, making fun of me? No, no. Oh my god! Don't step on the door. That's uh. I'm it's, sorry, I didn't see it. Sorry about. Oh, poopsie! Oh, oh, she just kind of like, takes the dog over. There. <laughs> sorry, man. Sorry. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's grass. Uh, I'll have a pint of what? that. You don't. You don't you want a pint of that. He's pointing at the top shelf, like some <laughs> you don't want insanely fancy looking <laughs> bottle. Oh, oh, hey, yeah, 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 pint, yeah. Please. yeah oh. I, I'm speaking up for have my friend. We'll take uh, that. Uh, that points to the bottom shelf. Yeah, that one over there. <laughs> well, I suppose it's easier to access anyway. Claudia, what, what were you saying? He'll pay for this. You were saying it's grass. Yes, it's uh grass it's just you know it's you know how our grass is like dead and, and, and you know crunchy this is what it looks like when it was alive he's gonna start tap dancing on some grass yeah i feel it. it's very good everyone's like walking around it, looking very confused and concerned is it like a, a pet like area where the pets can <laughs> be <laughs> yeah i so guess so because people are stepping on dogs yeah can we smoke it can you smoke the grass? I wouldn't advise it. That would be very bad for you, health-wise. Yeah, it's not going to do anything, and you're just going to be sick. It's so soft. I mean, you... what's left without a bit of risk, am I right? There's no, I'm not, there's, there's not a, it's not a risk thing. It's That's a, just a net loss. It's just, I yeah. show you a few places that are risky. No. There's no benefit. Oh, come on. Zero benefit whatsoever. You bet you could try, the, try this. It wasn't a joke. <laughs> Would you say try this when you try? Yeah, Gareth's handing out a, his cup of whatever Cheetle pointed at. Yeah, it's the, yeah that, uh, that, should, that should treat you well. Wait, not... Uh, uh -huh. Could I get another one, please? I'm glad that they're enjoying this. Uh, he, he, uh, he, he won't have any more. You do realize they mark up prices here at the Star Seaport, right? Wait, you mean beyond this one that I'm holding in my hand, right? Yes, well, yes. So oh. you, you can have okay, your one good. drink because we you. were on solid ground again. Yes, but I mean, uh, second one, we should probably go to like an actual bar out of the port. Out of the port? It, oh. Yes. We're, oh, sweetheart, you, uh... Yeah, this, this, I mean, well, this is Lwendolyn, mm -hmm. but this is only a part of it. Is there, like, an elevator? Can we, like, look down, like, at everything? I've never, I've never been to a city, like, a big, big city. It, yeah, well, well, let's, uh, we should probably go get some rooms. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, we're gonna go ahead. I'm, I'm, <laughs> sorry, my brain's died. Uh, I need to check in with the, uh, the embassy and let them know that we're coming and to arrange a meeting with the Senate. So, uh, but first, we should probably get some rooms. Um, uh, it's been a while since I've been in, uh, Gwendolyn. Um, and my armor has seen significant change. It, okay, okay. Is it all right for me to move about? Oh, yeah, no, absolutely. I'd, I'd recommend you. We should probably check in first to our rooms, so that at least you have a, a place that you can you can go back to. Marius is uh, Marius's <laughs> current R is his oh, guardian Oh, sorry, sorry. Poops, oh. Oh. <laughs> So many dogs here. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of dogs. <laughs> uh, Marius's guardian core is uh well over eight feet so he's sort of like trying to keep much like he's always been trying to keep his sort of hands to his side not making any quick motions around uh especially being here at least in asmodia there was way more open room because everything was barren but being back in a city he's sort of realizing that his suit is a little too large so what what do you uh what do you what do you what do you need to do what do you try what do you try to tell me what's up i'm just I just don't want us to get booted uh, out of a place because I stepped and broke something. Oh, you'll you'll be fine. Have you seen the guards here? Uh, not in a while, no. Yeah, they 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 their suits a little bigger than yours, so uh, you're you're not as uh, as scary as you think you are. 
Oh. They've made upgrades. Mm, yes, indeed. There's a a small peak in his voice as he uh, as you hear that familiar hum to his helmet, and he's uh, he's getting ready to record. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let me just uh, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. <laughs> take notes. <laughs> exactly. Ooh, uh, Garrett, upgrade. Garrett's going to bend down and grab a handful of like the the grass. Uh, it has a sort of uh, plasticky touch to it. Hmm. No, rip it out and. Hey, Bunny, if you want to try later, perhaps. Oh, thank you, thank you. That's mm. that's not real. It, oh my god. It's not okay. real? Well, what do you mean? mean? It's, 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 he lifts up the, the, the plastic sheet of grass. He's like, it's, it's not real. We're inside a starport. Oh. Hmm. There's real grass out, like, there's plenty of parks that you can go to. I still wouldn't recommend smoking that either, because that's not really going to do anything for you. Yeah, it's not good for eating either, honestly, unless you're really in a dire situation. I, I wouldn't recommend it. Well, is this place a joke? Why would they be farming something that you cannot eat nor well, smoke? It's so oh, nice to nap on. It's, it's um, it's not meant for uh, necessity as it is for decoration. Well, it also just like grows in the wild where there's a lot of rain and snow and stuff. So like, it's not, it's not like it's really hard or anything. It just it doesn't doesn't really grow in Asmodia. Yeah, it's uh, nothing grows in Asmodia except you know potatoes. But- Potatoes and wheat, yeah. But even then, it's uh, not entirely nutritious. It's just to knock back starvation. A full belly is always a good thing. What are we eating, then? It, well, yeah. Do, are you hungry? Well, I'm yes. always hungry. Well, let's... I'm hungry. You too. Mm-hmm. Me too. I know some I'm really good hungry. places. Well, let's... Yeah, we know this. We know this, Vizika. Well, let's, yeah, uh... I didn't know you were also always very hungry, too. Is this a bonding moment? Yes. <laughs> hey, I'm hungry, too. <laughs> Don't try. Really? Uh, this uh, we're, this we're is our moment. Yeah. very hungry. Yeah. Well, okay. You can have this moment. Oh. Marius, are you hungry? <laughs> I mean, I am a bit peckish. <laughs> wow. Wow, you're mm. hungry, too? Me, too. <laughs> we should probably go check in. Before you all lose your your minds, let's go. <laughs> she just turns away. Whatever. <laughs> I wasn't fucking hungry and hungry. We'll do that to you. I guess I'll just go eat out of a fucking trash can or whatever. You know, crazy. Oh, oh, I, I'm really good at, at jump diving. No, uh, <laughs> no I know I'm how to find I... the best snacks <sighs> in the dumpsters. I think been there. I don't want to go back. I mean, I think we lost Gareth. Where'd Gareth is staring up at like the monorail, just like watching it occasionally Gareth! come by. Gareth, mm-hmm. you're getting lost, kid. Come on. <sighs> what is this fool doing now? All right. Well, I I think we could allocate the uh, three bedrooms. So we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be sharing bedrooms. So, uh, pick a bug, mate. All right. So, uh, Cheetle will be in a bed, uh, bedroom. Um, but, uh, let's, uh, let's go down. Uh, Gareth, who would you like to stay with? He's obviously Mm. staying with Cheetle. They're soulmates. Right, (laughs) right, right. Obviously. Understood. He's like, oh, okay. (laughs) Very sweet of you. Thank you. Um, Vizika, who are you staying with? She, she, she looks around like. Um, 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 so, uh, um, she touches their claws together. So, um, what? <laughs> Anyone you want to share with me? Uh, me? <gasps> yeah, we could eat snacks all night long. Oh, that sounds very good. That sounds so familiarity. 
It's crazy. What room are you going to be in? That's fucking wild. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You can sleep on the couch. How about that? Hey, 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 hey. No, <laughs> that's, don't do that again. I don't want to be on the couch. Uh, so, uh, you will walk in. I woke up with all the cats on me. <laughs> you will, uh, wake up, or wake up, Jesus. You'll, um... <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Everything. <laughs> Past ten sessions have been a dream. Oh. Um, <laughs> no. Not that trope. Fuck. Uh, uh, you'll uh, you'll kind of watch as uh, Cheetah will walk into the lobby area. He'll check in. Uh, three room, please. Three rooms, please. And we're like, all right, you got rooms one hundred one. Uh, sorry, uh, three hundred one, three eleven, and three twelve. And it's like, okay, everyone. Jam into the elevator. It's gonna be a tight fit. I am sorry. That's what she said. Um. Ow, ow, get stop that. Ow, ow. Marius, say, hey, Marius, you should probably take, uh, and he kind yeah, of points over, points okay. over to the right yeah, elevator. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the rest of us are gonna take the left elevator, okay? Uh, there I will go. join you, brother. <laughs> I mean, I appreciate the solidarity, but uh, <laughs> yeah, that works. I mean, a little more, a little more room in here. That that works for me. You know, that's fine. Little Claude, his Claude finger reaches out, presses the button, and waits for the elevator. All right. Vizika presses three extra buttons on the way. <laughs> oh come on! <laughs> she also up. presses three extra buttons. Come on! <laughs> Gary oh, also me. presses three extra buttons. Oh, wait, She's hey. got like a, like a foot like pushed up against Cheeto, keeping him away from the buttons. Hey, 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 hey! <laughs> this is all right. All right. You're in here. No, no, no. <laughs> We're not stuck in here with you. You're stuck in here with us. Yeah, take your, take your time. Press the buttons. That's, that, that's cute. Beep, that's beep, really cute. Beep, 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 beep. Well, now that everyone's pressed all the buttons, um... It takes five hours to get to the top floor. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's go, uh... Ding. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get our rooms, eh? Uh, okay, so you, you said which... 301, 311, well, and 312. Yeah, they're over here. They're over here. You're going the wrong direction. They're over here. They're over here. This one's locked. Yeah, that's not our room, Gareth. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. All right. As he's stopping, he pauses for a moment, a hand coming up to catch on the wall as he looks back. What are you doing? <laughs> You, uh, what are you doing? You're trying to open that door? <laughs> what? Well, no. I'm good. coming. It's the, the it's, it's the stairwell. <laughs> oh, good. In case of escapes. Yeah, okay. Huh? Go on. What? I was just... It's important to have know-how of where we got and mm -hmm. what we do. Mm -hmm. With your... Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, sorry. I like how yeah. we oh, got open. off on the third floor, so all of the buttons that we pressed are just like we're inconveniencing any other people that might need the elevator <laughs> and not ourselves. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's 312 over there. That's one of the rooms. Oh, this room's clear. Where, where are we at? Which one is clear. This room's clear. I mean... <laughs> It's, it's, a room. it's ultimately up to you. Uh, Gareth, we're in, we're in Wimbledon, friend. There isn't going to be much cause for Excuse me? concern here. Uh, you yeah. never be too concerned. Yeah, Gareth. Yeah, Zika. Gareth, Did this you is good. That one? Okay. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, is, right. is, is either of them better? Uh, I think this one's a little bigger. Oh. I think we should take that one. Yeah, does it? Yeah, we should take this one. Uh, okay. Mm. Okay. Hmm. The room with a view. Yeah, you can see the the Wonderland streets. I can see discover new. What? <laughs> <laughs> discover new <laughs> worlds. It's an advertisement <laughs> for uh, Europa, the the planet of Europa. Oh, wow! Boom. This, this this is very Zanya high. Will up. Lay on the bed. Oh, the bed. Uh, feels extremely soft, and I will let it. I will let you decide if it's comfortable or uncomfortable. Because you're used to old hard beds and and cots and things like that. This is this feels like you're on a fucking the softest thing you've ever laid on. 
<laughs> Vanya <laughs> will will kind of panic, uh, thinking that it's something is happening. So, what is this? What is this? Someone has someone has cursed this item. She will get up. Mazika's gonna hop on. She's gonna like leap onto the bed and curl up on a nice big fluffy pillow and just close her eyes and like ah, as she sinks into the pillow. This is the best. Now what are you doing? This is oh, cursed. It's filled with maybe feathers, maybe something like It was like swallowing feathers. me whole. Yeah, that's the point. <laughs> Do it again. You'll see. Is it gonna eat you? It's a bed. Is it's a bed. Open? It's not a monster, it's a bed. You just hear it screaming <laughs> from the northern rooms. <laughs> <laughs> Reluctantly, she's not gonna to know like, up, but... you know, finger first, like a hand, just like, okay, just, she's on the very edge of the bed. Is he just gonna yeah. hook a claw under one of the blankets and like toss it over Vanya? <laughs> like, instinctively, she just, she'll catch it. What? It's the best what blanket ever. What does it all feel like this? Just, this just is an enchantment. No, this is luxury. <laughs> Doodle. I didn't know you were into luxurious things, Vizika. It's been so long. You're full of surprises. Toodle. Yeah, what's up? How, how sure are you of the stability of this building? This is uh, very high up. I'm... More sure about the stability of this building than any other building we've been in in Asmodia. <laughs> you see, Gareth, Gatos has something we call civic planning. And code. Like building codes that need to be followed every step of the way just so that thing that you're talking about never happens. Well, he's going to close the, the blinds. Yeah, I was like, you can close the blinds if you feel a little uncomfortable, buddy. It's okay. I'd, I'd rather not think about it. Yeah, I, I, didn't know you, I didn't know you had fear of heights. I'm so sorry. Would have gotten us a, a room at, like, you know, a lower floor or something. He's just sitting on the edge of the bed, just breathing, like, almost panicky. Oh, yeah, you're going to need a minute. Um, Cheats and Marius, what are you two doing? There's a air of familiarity as he's sort of like just sort of touching things, moving things, uh, sort of shifting things around in the room until eventually his suit is facing towards the window. The back panel opens uh, and he sort of reaches up, grabbing the handles on the back and sort of pulls himself out of his armor. Oh, there it is, baby. We get that no helm look. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> What does Marius wear under his armor? Uh, he has uh, some very simple garb, uh, mm -hmm. all things considered. I have a, a picture of it. I'll, uh, I'll describe it as well. It's post not just white boxers. Post, <laughs> post <laughs> a <laughs> picture. Post a picture. I'll post a picture. I'll post a picture. Uh, but it, uh, it's, it's rather... Uh, it's rather rugged in appearance. It uh, Post a picture. <sighs> Post like, first, explain later. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Describe later. Where? Ah, <gasps> Picks. <laughs> there it is. I put it into into the shadows reach. Uh, so he has a, a very simple sort of long sleeve shirt um, that on one side, the sleeve is uh, completely gone. It's sort of bound by these uh, sort of darker straps that uh, are connected to the entire right prosthetic limb. Uh he has a set of uh, sort of darker, uh, like, cargo pants that he's wearing uh, that are sort of connected down to some very thick boots. Uh, he looks very much like a uh, like an engineer, like what you would expect mm. somebody who works at Arkman to look like. Very cool. God, this picture's massive. Hold on. <laughs> 
So wait, so he actually has a prosthetic arm and leg? Is that right? Yes. His, okay, uh, okay. Sorry, up, all the way up to his right shoulder is a uh, prosthetic arm, and his right leg all the way up to about halfway through his thigh is prosthetic as well. Gotcha. What else can you tell us about this? Uh, okay, we're good. So this is what it looks like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of uh, a lot of those crystal motifs that he has, uh, it very much showing that these are all things that he himself has made. All right. So, ah, uh, you may continue. Uh, getting out of the armor finally. There's that moment where he pushes his shoulders back. The audible full like pop of his spine as he exhales slowly and then turns to look so how do you feel about being uh somewhere where there's some uh i mean honestly i was gonna get used to never you know it was, I was, uh... he pauses for a moment sort of shifting on a heel but how are you feeling Huh? Yeah, I'm fine. It's nice to be back in the city, right? It's nice. I mean, don't think I've been here really before. The Windolin is a bit more dense than Arkmund, so. Yeah, no kidding. But don't worry. We have plenty of opportunities to explore. And I believe, uh, he sort of grimaces. Hellebore lives here. <laughs> I mean, oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. That's... <laughs> what? Why do you hate him? Because Just like plops a... down on the thing after she's got her face like pushed against the glass. He's a bad influence. Oh, please. I've seen a lot of the folk that come into your shop all the time. There are plenty of bad influences, Bellino. There are people that need help. Don't forget, <laughs> you were one of those people that came into my shop. Yeah, I know. I'm the bad influence. No, you That's weren't. That's what I'm talking about. Hellebore was the bad influence. <sighs> Let's talk about something else. It's fine. I'm starving anyway. Fucking hungry. Uh, you can, mm. uh, for all of you, you can go out to eat or you can get yourself room service. Oh my god. We want to go oh on a we wanna go on a family picnic or uh, we want to all eat in our rooms. <laughs> <laughs> do you think? Do you think they have uh, what's that stuff we used to get all the time? The one where we go and like we cook the meat on. Uh, uh, like own little grill. Mm. Do you have those here? I don't see why not. Although I'd probably he there's like almost this revelation moment where he immediately sort of pats himself, grabs his phone, <laughs> and then realizes, oh, connection. <laughs> <laughs> I can actually call people on the shard phone. Oh. Oh God, I don't know anybody. <laughs> <laughs> it's more so that he can just, he can finally connect to it. Uh, we're, yeah, we're going to go look up, uh, see if there's any of those. Uh, God, what are those? What are they even called? Hey, Vanya. Oh. They're like yes. one goal, like the, the I'm like, really hungry. Let's go bother Korean them. barbecue or whatever. Uh, Is right. it Korean barbecue? Uh, Ishtarian right. barbecue. Absolutely. Ishtarian barbecue. Yeah. Can we go get some Ishtarian barbecue? <laughs> <laughs> knock, 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 knock. Hello. Ah. <laughs> oh. Knock, 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 knock. Hello! Could have been naked. Well, the, the door's open, so like... Yeah. Okay. I'm a free person, you know? Yeah, okay. We were just talking about going and getting some Ishtar and barbecue. What? Hey, is, uh, is anyone naked in there before I walk in? Yeah! <laughs> no, me. All right. Uh, uh, <laughs> did I hear it's bar? something that we usually do on my birthday. I love it. <gasps> is it your go. birthday? Um, uh, 
We were, uh... What are they doing We there, were on the barge. I don't know. I thought it was naked, so I don't want to go in there. You can come in. Oh. Oh, my God! I'm naked! See, I don't want to go like, in there. looks at the door. I don't want to go in there. <laughs> Cheeto, it please. <laughs> It's okay. The only rule is that you also have to get naked before you come in. Yeah, I'm not getting naked. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I am gonna get naked, but not in there. Thank oh. God. You know, oh. I'm, I'm just oh. gonna go. I'm just gonna go take a shower. I'll be right. Uh, you know, you you go in there, enjoy the orgy or whatever. Oh, all right. <laughs> I have coming some, in. I have some credits. Huh? Hello. Oh no, nobody's naked in here. What are you? <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why his deal is. He's been so Wait a minute. <laughs> Nobody's naked in here. Where's my Oh, sorry. I forgot I got to do a thing. Hold up. Boop, boop, boop. I mean... You're not supposed to see in the uh, bathroom. Um, about how expensive is... uh Would be like a meal. Of, of is like, it like Japan it, where a thousand is... Ten, Wait, isn't like, it covered? Yeah, it, it was it's paid for by the fact that we're, you know, in the Senate. Um, Kilo said it's paid for. So for 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 an entire table's worth, uh, it would cost 50 credits uh, for a uh, barbecue meal. Is the government not covering our meals? I'm just answering the question. I, yeah. yeah, I asked that. But are they, though? <laughs> We can speak with Cheetle, and if not, I do not mind paying for Cheetle? it. Cheetle does not want to come in here. Oh, man, he's scared of the naked so body. Excited. He said they're gonna pay for it, so I don't know. We can like give him the check after. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry. Well, there might be a an issued card or some creds so that he'll give us. Oh, okay. Let's go bother him while he's in the shower. Uh, God. What room was he's it in again? The shower? Perhaps it's not wise to bother him while he's in. Oh, Why not? Vizika, what are you doing? Is this this bed room? is huge. Indeed. Um, knock, 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 knock. I suppose God. it's fitting for one of your size. You hear? You just hear water <laughs> running. Hey, Tito! <laughs> Got the screaming at him. Yeah. Oh boy. How do we pay for our food? Don't worry about it. It's on the Senate. Should we just tell them it's on It's on the Senate when we go to, like, a restaurant? Yeah, just jack up the price. Fuck them. Okay. <laughs> All right. <gasps> hey, we're, we're just supposed to tell them that the Senate's going to pay for it, and it's fine to spend as much money as we want, because fuck the Senate. Um. Hmm. Yep. I see. Are you just and laughing the crowd like wow? We um we have no proof that we're here to see the Senate is the issue. Well I asked Cheetle and he, he said it's fine, just tell them that we're here to see the Senate when we get there. I think he didn't hear you correctly, Vizika. I think you no, need to get I mean, in there and well, just I asked, ask I asked him what, face how do we to pay face. For uh, I don't know. The door was locked. Uh, it's dude, fine. I asked him, how do we pay for our food? He said, it's fine. It's, it's fine. We'll go. We'll go. I'll yeah. find, I'll find a grill. We'll, yeah. we'll go there. Yeah. And then uh, we'll tell them we're with the sun. And if it yeah. doesn't work, I'll just pay for the meal. No, that's a bad idea. If anything, we can call Cheetle and ask for help. Cheetle's walking out, dripping, ah! wrapped, in a, oh. wrapped in a towel. <sighs> Sorry, what was that? Oh, my God. Oh, I, I was asking how we're, we're paying for our food, but you answered it. Yeah. But yeah. You, yeah, but you, you you got you need the you need the card first. You need the oh. card master's card. Oh. Okay. Do you have that? Yeah, it's all me. Are you, oh. are you are you guys looking to get food now? Yeah. Oh, can you like? We can wait for you. I mean, if the water pressure is really good. Go I like haven't that. had a. I haven't had a proper shower in so long. You know what I'm saying? Ugh. Yeah. Have any of you oh, showered Garrett yet? Is here. No. No. You got them. I suppose it does have a point. I don't mean it like you stink, sort of. Way. I mean, it's more of like he cleans over. You just got to The water pressure, nothing compared. Pressure. As, as mode. Oh, yeah. Oh. Pressure. Water pressure, huh? Oh. Yeah. He's inviting mm. you to join him in the shower. Go! I'm not. Go! I've... Go! Go! Oh. 
<sighs> what? Look. Listen, I'm I'm gonna I've, I'm gonna finish up here, and then I've go. Never had, actually had a shower. What? What is a shower? Oh, buddy, it's uh, hey, it's check it out. You you know what? Out. You know, come yes. in, come here. It, the, the, and you kind of come in. You hear the water already going out. It's like steaming in here. And he's like, "All right, you're gonna go in there. You're gonna disrobe, and then you're gonna get underneath that that nozzle over there, spraying that water down. You're gonna feel like a new man, girl. Just go underneath it. Oh well, yeah, make sure you disrobe first. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. I <laughs> <laughs> doing there? Um I'm taking my armor off. Yes, go and take your armor off. He like puts it in the sink. Like he thinks it's like a storage. Uh, I'm sorry, DM, can we get the central music back for this? Hey uh, yeah, make sure you take off your clothes underneath the armor as well. You want to be completely Where do I hang my sword? Just leave it against the corner. Probably don't get any water on it, though. Right. You want to be butt finally, naked for this. He finally gets everything off, and then he's going to step under the shower. It's like a hot, oh. steaming Oof. shower with, with heavy water pressure pounding on your naked body. Oh my it burns. God. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> hey, just this for is... the audio people, Gareth, can you describe? <laughs> <laughs> the steam is uh, is rolling over uh, over over your ankles. Can we have some shower ASMR, please? <laughs> the water rolls over his rippling shoulders as he. <laughs> okay, no. <never mind. laughs> Cheetle, it's too hot. Okay, but move what it. Is... Move, there should be a knob there. Move it a little to the right until it cools down. He's going to grab the shower head and, like, try and twist it. No, it... Do you, have not, the, do you see the working. nozzle? It should be on the wall. Like, at, like, torso length. Torso length? Y yeah, <laughs> the, around, around your torso. Maybe, like, around your belly or something. Oh, um... <laughs> Do you see the little knob? <laughs> I think so. Okay. Now, uh, grasp turn. the knob. I've okay. Firmly grasp it. Firmly grasp it. Well, don't firmly <laughs> grasp it. You're a strong man. It's like the. Well, the it kind of looks not like. Not too firmly. It kind of <laughs> looks like the 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 edge of your hilt. You know what I mean? That little round round knob. <laughs> you have an H I, and, an, and a C on it. Oh, I see this, yes. Yeah, yeah, okay. Now, firmly grasp it and then turn it to the right. And if you can't figure this out, I'm going to ask Vanya to come in and help you. Mm. All right, I need to roll some sort of check. Let's try this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, he'll, he'll do it correctly, but he'll turn it all the way to cold. Now, you want to turn it slowly. Okay. Well, it's too late for that. I... Okay, I think I understand now. Yeah, the pull the, the left okay. and right. Okay. It is an appropriate temperature and I'm under the water. Now what? Uh, relax. Enjoy. There should be a bar of soap over there. Or at least a, a one that's wrapped up so you are not don't use mine. And uh, yeah, enjoy. Take your time. Relax, big guy. You earned it. Hmm. <laughs> Right, he's going to take probably half an hour to try. And, he's just going to fuddle around in here. Okay. <laughs> okay. Half an hour. Trying to shower. During uh, during the other half hour, what's... Uh, oh, what's uh, what's going on in here? Looks at uh, Vizika and Vanya. <laughs> oh, yeah. So Vizika's seen a shower before, but it's been a very long time. So she, like, she doesn't take her clothes off yet. She darts in, turns mm -hmm. it on, and then darts out and, like, looks expectantly up at Vanya. All right. And then you wash in that. It's really nice. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, okay. Um. All right. Yeah. I, can you hold my my, my hat? Um, yeah. <clears throat> you, you put it on the counter. Right. Oh. 
All right, and uh, I guess my uh, my coat, my coat. Hey, you, you can you can hang it on that rack <laughs> right there. It's like it's right. There's a rack and there's like some hooks on the door, and you can right. like. Yeah. <laughs> Vizika's gonna just like basically pull, pull her arms into her sides and like jump, and her her like coverings will just whoop, down. Uh, <laughs> she steps out of them, and steps under the water, and immediately just is a wet rat. <laughs> like all her fur just smooshes down and she closes her eyes I am uh, I might, I might, can I see you while this is happening or no yes Are we, Yes. Oh, I assume so this is like a glass I am uh, kind of <laughs> terrified by, by the sight in front of me but I don't really <laughs> Really say anything? I just my eyes are very large. As I, you, you gotta, you gotta try this. It's, 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 is that is, mm, is that what's gonna happen to me? Uh, I don't, I don't do know. you have fur? I mean, in some places. Uh, then in some places. <laughs> God <No>. Damn. <laughs> have you never been in water before? Like, have you gone for a swim ever? Have you been in an ocean and you've like come out of it? You know, like. Have you have you dunked in a tub of cold water? Have you been in a water barrel? Have you been rained on? <laughs> it's like that, oh. but better. Right. Uh, mm. <laughs> well, yes to some of your questions. <laughs> Audience, I will be putting a content warning in the description. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Shower RP happens in this episode. Where did <laughs> where did all the viewership come from? What what is happening? Here? <laughs> Just wait till the beach episode. <laughs> hey yo! <laughs> Are you getting in or what? <sighs> okay. All right. Wow. Uh... Oh, fine, fine, fine. Vanya will just take it all off, and she just she starts showering. The the Sims <laughs> censored area immediately. <laughs> yes, the mosaic. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we can close that door now and just kind of <laughs> pee out on the street. <laughs> <laughs> What, uh, what's going on? What's, what's going on in here? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> if I let you take a shower first, are you going to save me any hot water? Uh, I mean, you could ask me to. <laughs> Would you please save me some hot water? <sighs> Don't do this. <laughs> Come on, a little more effort. Would you please? Save me some hot water, or I will take a shower first, and then you will what? get home. Hey, what the hell? Yeah, I guess. Thank you. Now go take a shower. What? <laughs> Can't you see I'm taking in the sight? I can see you stewing. Ew. How can you? She, like, looks over herself. <laughs> How can you see that? What do you mean? <laughs> Please go take a shower. Ugh. 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 All right, half hour has passed, and uh, yeah, she looks like he's dangling his little, little he's dangling his little feet out on the uh. Uh, over our, o over at the bed, and he's like, uh, Garrett, how you doing in there? You didn't drown, right? I'm fine. I'm just finishing up. He's okay. washing his face in the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. Well, we're gonna go ahead and get some 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 food, some barbecue. Hey, <laughs> I do need to start by, stop by the embassy though. So uh, to do that. All right. All right. I'm coming. You, you, you're coming clothed, right? Uh, yeah, he's he's fully clothed. Okay, good, good. Back in his armor. All Wait, right. Where'd you go? I'm, I'm out here at the hall. I'm oh. trying to gather everyone. All right. 
And Cheats returns from the shower, and when she opens it, she's in, like, one of those real, like, fluffy bathrobes. <laughs> and, like, her <laughs> hair is, like, foof, like, it's all puffed up. And <laughs> she's got, like, a drying, like, fluffy fro going on. Oh, my God. It's amazing. You're welcome. Huh. <sighs> It's a mess in there. <laughs> God, I assume so. <laughs> I can. Uh, I'm sorry. I kind of just like took my clothes off everywhere. You know. You know. <laughs> Mario spends the first five minutes gathering all of Cheetah's things to bring it out of the bathroom, <laughs> uh, and then goes in with Presty to <laughs> clean up the bathroom so <laughs> that he can use it. Holy shit, <sighs> Brett. Yes. What question in your DMs. <laughs> oh, you you asked me a question. Yeah. Mm. <sighs> There's more. another bathrobe in there. I didn't take both of them. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yes. Vanya, have you tried the shower? Yes, yes, uh, I have. Did you try it as well? Well, I, I think I used it correctly. I, what, I'm all what wet now, though. You think? Well, um, I, I didn't know exactly what all it, those extra. What? Wait, what? You're wet? Wash. You are wet? Is that what you said? <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, yes. I guess stood under the shower. <clears throat> it was. I'm sorry, uh, does that have to do with Cheadle? Is that a thing that... Well, Cheadle told me to think... take a shower. And... Um, okay, um, there are towels, you know. Towel? Mm. Hold on. Uh, oh, boy. What? Did you not Is use it... a towel? <laughs> oh, yeah. There's a okay. fucking okay. Ocean Under the... where he's been walking. <laughs> Under the armor holder, I got it. Yeah. I got it. Ugh. Jeez. She's just gonna walk out with her clothes clutched in a claw and walk past them, ah! just far <laughs> enough away, <laughs> and then and then start shaking herself off like a dog. Just. Azika, what are you doing? He's covering his I, eyes. I didn't want to get the room wet, and, and continues shaking herself the... off. Do it in and then... the, Do it in your room. What? Well, I didn't want to get the room wet. <laughs> And then as soon as she's done shaking herself off, she puts her clothes on. Oh. <laughs> I'll have to dry myself again. I'll be right back. Yep. <laughs> Badia, how did you do? Was Did you do better than Garrett huh. when it came to the shower? I, thi uh, I, th I think so. I mean, I'm... Did you know pretty... what the towel was? <laughs> Yes, she looks well, very proud of herself. Yes, yes. you're miles, <laughs> yes, you're miles, miles <laughs> ahead. Nothing to worry about. And you put your clothes on before leaving the room. <laughs> looks back over at a closet. Well, there's nobody musical. in the hallway. Like, who's gonna complain? Uh, me, a little bit. Oh, you were in a towel too earlier, Chizo. Oh, come yeah, on, don't we be lived like in, that. We yeah. lived in barracks together. I know. Yeah. Well, whatever. Okay. It's just saying. We're, we're, we're now in the we're now in the cradle of civilization you know we have to make oh. sure that we're at least got our pants on before we walk out you oh, know what I mean? come on who needs pants live a little cheetle i i so, I, so I, you're I, saying that now we're not good enough for our surroundings so we have to change our entire personalities based on the place that we are in the i'm, not, I'm, not, I'm uh. not asking you there we just there's very few rules you got to follow okay uh you got to make sure that you're properly clothed at all times while in public places this hallway right here is a public place okay? but we have like three rooms here this is our public place it's not our, none of it is our public place, okay? We're ah. ready the rooms out. We don't own this. Second of all, uh, no guns in the Senate. Oh. <laughs> Close that fire. Huh? <laughs> what do you mean? No guns I'm... in the Senate. <laughs> what about swords? No swords either. They're going to take, your, they're going to confiscate all your weapons when we arrive tomorrow. What? Or Wait, whenever like, we're arriving. Like, no, give it not. back, or like, do we gotta leave it here? No, they'll give it back, but they, they, you won't be able to walk around with it. Okay. Uh, That's fine. Can I stay outside then? 
No, you, you, I need you. Vanya, I need you. Do you need me for what? I, to, to, to tell them what happened. To blast them? No, you've got nothing to blast. They'll take your gun. <laughs> what about plan B? What's plan B? Yeah, well, what if they team? decide not to help us? I what? I, I thought plan I, B was we blasting them. No, That's plan, what I pl recall. Plan B is B we do it blast? on our own. Is that plan A, blasting them? No, there's no blasting. You won't be Wait, able to blast them. how are we going to do it on our own? That's impossible. That's why we ran away in the first place, because we can't do it on our own. I agree. It's going to be a death sentence. We're going to have a real good time here in this magical place before we die to the space baby. I don't want to die. Well, I won't die either, so we're going to make mm. our case. Okay. We're not leaving here unless we get support. Okay, so then there's no need for a plan B. Because we're not leaving unless we get support. So, like, we might spend a really long time here. There might be a need for a maybe, plan B. Maybe we'll spend long enough here that the space baby comes over here, and then they have to deal with it anyway. I mean, that's true, but then, you know, the home that we've been defending for so long will be gone. Yeah, I'm gonna miss those potatoes. Yeah. And we're well, probably... Speaking of potatoes, can we go eat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, let me see what's, uh, uh let's just... Cheats! Marius! Huh? <laughs> the door knocking on the door. She, like, gonna knock on this walks door. over to the, to the, like, little <laughs> area. Little peephole. Yeah. You, you guys almost done in there? We're about to go eat. It was my idea to go eat. You can't leave without me. Why? Well, that's what I'm asking. Is it time for you to get going? Uh, she like looks down at her big fluffy robe and like her hair. Uh, it's the moment. Okay. <laughs> I would like to rummage these things for clothes. Is there any nice clothes in there? Uh, no, it's empty. Oh, you... <laughs> what about under the bed? Uh, yeah, they, they, you got the blanket. Ow. There's no clothes in here. Why would there be clothes? Why not? Because it's, I think there's not. God, the Senate really just doesn't want us to have nice places. <laughs> Where is my full outfit that comes in every hotel room I've been in? <sighs> <laughs> what are you doing? Me. Well, I, uh, I realized I uh, came out of the showering area without my clothes. Your clothes are over here. So I was looking for. Oh. <laughs> you don't see me put them over there when you left a mess in the bathroom? No. Well, that's why I put them. And I cleaned them. So you're welcome. Mm. Right. Yeah, whatever. Thank you. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> A glimpse of domestic life. <laughs> Morris getting his own clothes clean. What are you doing? Washing your clothes Dressed. in the toilet? <laughs> no, Marius. No, I'm talking, I'm talking to Cheats, who like ran uh, in and was like, I heard sounds. She has to I get changed. I thought she, she comes was, out like running her like hands through her hair. I thought she was like dunking her clothes in the sink or something to wash it. No, <laughs> no she comes out dressed and she's like, all right, I'm ready. Her hair as wild as ever. Are you leaving your weapons behind? She, like, turns around and her whip is attached at her back like a tail. Understood. <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing. Uh, what? Marius eventually gets himself cleaned up. He uh, sort of dries himself off, gets everything. And then once he's fully dressed, he would get back into his armor. Oh, uh, you're going to wear your armor? If you're bringing your weapon, I have to bring my armor. Oh, come on. It's been so long since I've gotten to see you without it on. If you leave your whip, I'll leave the armor. Well, I, I hardly see how the two are even comparable. If you are bringing a weapon... Yours covers your fear, whole body. Mine is a... Is, uh, my armor is a weapon. 
<laughs> My body is a weapon. You can't expect me to go out without. <sighs> Fine. She like okay. pulls it and sets it onto the like thing here. He would uh, sort of crawl back out of the armor, bring a hand back. He'd push back his hair uh, and give a very, uh, very soft smile. But I'm bringing, I'm bringing the coat. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> All right, let's go get some chow. All right, so you guys are leaving to eat. Is that correct? Yes. Food. <laughs> I was watching Zika sprint <laughs> down the hallway. <laughs> All right, then. <clears throat> uh, right around the area, you'd find a, a uh, Ishtarian um, barbecue joint that seems to be popular around the area, specifically with those that work within the Senate Hall. Um, Cheats immediately puts down the, the his quartermaster's card, allowing him to cover for the entire expenses. Uh, he, uh, will also continue with you guys and say, uh, okay, now look, uh, you know, help yourself to, to, to food, some drink, and you don't, you know, splurge a little bit. You're, you're, you're on the mainland, and it's been, it's been quite a while, so let's go ahead and take it easy, okay? And then, uh, yeah, whatever they need, he, he'll say over to the, the server. And then he says, I am going to be at the embassy. Try and save some food for me. If you don't, I understand. I mean, we can just ask him to bring out more meat, silly. She like punches his arm. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> bye, don't bye. be too long, Cheeto. Bye oh, bye. It's gonna take as long as it's gonna take. Okay, bye. 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 I so, always hated that. Come back soon. Take as long as you said. So, have any of you ever had barbecue before? I've had cooked meat before. Is that what barbecue is? A similar premise. <laughs> a little bit more involved on our end. Here, let me show you. And then he would, uh, having everybody around in this sort of very, uh, this very quiet moment in comparison to everything that they've been through, he would teach them uh, how to do uh, this sort of like little barbecue for themselves and how to cook a, uh, how to cook food and uh, what's the what's a, what's a proper like what's a proper uh, meal and not rations. <laughs> As you're like teaching this, Vizika on like a corner seat has taken a plate of raw meat and is just digging in. Just oh oh no 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 no! <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're meant to use the little inset cooker, the little grill that's here. <clears throat> oh yeah, I can do both. I'll do both. You'll I'll watch as you'll watch as a gnome walks over with a <laughs> with a with a plate of meat. Uh, he's currently only wearing a loincloth and has a staff oh. attached to his back. Oh. Uh, this is a Ishtarian themed barbecue uh, based off of the heroic goblins of uh, of over a thousand years ago. Wow, I hate everything about this now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so nice the gnome like goes, goblin for you. <laughs> uh, and then he places oh, the meat down. Wow, thank you. <laughs> and then he walks away. <laughs> it's been so long I forgot what this place was like. <laughs> but yes, you'll you'll grill it. And they we have uh, sauces. So once you've grilled it, you can dip the cooked meat into some of the sauces and eat as it As you continue way. to talk, you watch as this l large, uh, what I could only describe as mascot of a goblin that seems to be wearing uh, like a band leader outfit and covered in all of these like stuffed ant, like stuffed <laughs> instrument surrounds holding up a, a plate of drinks and he's just kind of like Moving around a little disoriented, holding on to drink, splash it down on the oh, table. Oh, me, me. I'll take one. I'll front, take two. And then, uh, yeah. Gareth puts his hand on the sword hilt and just looks at Marius. Mm -mm. No, no, no. Not here. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, 
which the uh, he sort of like snaps the clawed hand for a moment and then points at mascot. It's the representative for the store. Yeah, it changes like every other month or so. This has always been the hard part. I have no idea what he's saying. <laughs> he's I, I would like everybody. What language are you speaking? Drinks for everybody. He uh, he'll move the uh, uh, you'll you'll see the mascot like move the mouth, kind of rip it back like Velcro, Velcro, and you just kind of see these actual lips behind it. You guys want pickle shots? Uh, it's no take idea. for me, please. Yeah. Okay. Like pickle shot. You yes. want the you want the pickle sake? No, just just regular sake, please. Uh. Hot. I don't know if I I don't know if we do it without the the, the pickle. I'll have to ask my manager. Just take the pickle out. <laughs> That's not how it works. If they've been brining it, you're pickle. not going to get the pickle out of it. It's going to taste like pickle regardless of there's pickle in it or not. Ugh. It, just just bring us some, please. Okay. That's the goblin month. Just just Ooh. wait. Just wait. I fucking hate goblin month. Yeah, next month is ac uh, academia month, and that's where they uh, <laughs> turn everything into like this sort of like magical school motif. Uh, you always based. get here <laughs> too late. Is it the goblin month for my birthday or is it? <sighs> it's going to be goblin month every time for your birthday. What are you talking about? I know. <laughs> it's how your birthday works. And then and then last last month was the demon invasion. Oh, Jesus. Which was still pretty fucking <laughs> morbid, but at the same time, they love to celebrate it. <laughs> Once the uh, once the sake is brought out, he would uh, he would reach over and sort of uh, take it into his hand, uh, the bottle or whatever they brought us, if it's a glass, um, and sort of very very gently sort of let the uh, the prosthetic hum, and then he would set it back down, and it would taste uh, without the pickle, and it would be uh, as warm as uh, Cheats likes it. Oh yeah. Forgot you was a witch. <laughs> Grab a <laughs> chocolate. <laughs> Just kind of like grinning. You can tell like the cheeks are pulled up and the mask is smiling. There's a <laughs> And then you, you hear from the stage in the front. Oh no, everybody! The fog is rolling in! Is that? It's everyone's favorite goblin, Skagzag! And then you see, like, someone <laughs> painted in green. Uh, also covered in, like, this sort of, like, cloud-like loin cloth. Step up on the stage. And uh, he's wearing, like, a big helmet. So it's definitely like a naked dude, right? Like a tiny naked <laughs> oh dude <my> covered in green, <laughs> but that has this helmet with the floppy ears. And you ah. just hear from in the, the mask, I hate humans. He hates humans, everyone. Thank you so much, Skagzag. <laughs> Why does he hate humans? It's, like, it's the bit that they're doing. It's part no, of the whole it's life. some gag. It's something old. I, I never understood it. It's from a book or something. I mean, if Cheeto was here, he could probably explain it. Cheeto, 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 shows up and goes, "Ah, damn, I miss Skagzak." And he puts it down. <laughs> he sits down. He was so good. He said that he hated humans. And I know. Oh, I missed it. He said it. He sometimes doesn't he say said it. it. Sometimes he, a lot of times he just goes, eh. It really depends on who they get under well, the mask. He, he said that he said. Mm. You have to yeah. chew. Mm. <laughs> no, she don't. And then he grabs three sticks of meat raw and then also does it yeah! the Zika style and just starts eating it. After, <laughs> after Marius mentioned the sauce, Zika starts like taking a bowl of sauce and she like puts a couple pieces of meat into it and she just like downs the whole thing as if it's a shot, the full bottle of sauce or the full bowl oh, of sauce. Like no, soup. Like no. soup. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, God, she's gonna be shitting herself. And you gotta that, slurp oh, down God. the sauce. You gotta, and he's also dunking the sauce in the, you gotta yeah! slurp it. 
You gotta soak down the sauce. Oh! It's so good. This is the best sauce ever. There's so much salt in here. <laughs> yeah. We're not gonna see them for the whole night, by the way. <laughs> oh. And I'm so glad I'm I roomed with you. Oh. So how how's the how's the the barbecue been treating you? <laughs> An experience, but I am thankful for uh, for a reprieve with all of you. Smiles and as he's smiling and he grabs one of the, the pickle shots and sips it a little bit. His his smile kind of stays there, but then you it feel you can kind of see like the mask cracking as he says tomorrow. And he finishes the shot, puts it down. The Senate wants to see us tomorrow. Damn. Thought we'd have a little more time. Yeah, I thought so too. This is probably the fastest they've uh, they've have been willing to to see us, which is concerning. Kind of looks oh. to everyone. Maybe that's a good thing. I hope. Mario sort of grimaces. Uh, his features fully exposed, not in his armor, so his expressions are plain for everybody to see. And he just sort of gives a soft shake of his head. That's not usually how it works in politics. If they want to see us that bad, I hope you're ready for bad news. Hmm. Maybe they want something from us, and so we can say that we want something from them, too. Or maybe right. they understand how big of a threat this is. Yeah, I'm not certain <laughs> why they want to see us so quickly. Like I said... This shit usually moves slow. The fact they're already ready to see us tomorrow? They had no idea we were coming, right? Right. Uh, we just tell them. Well, no, I just want the emissary to let them know that we wish to speak with the Senate. They said um, they would handle it. I mean, Did you tell them why? Well, no, I mean, that's for the senators itself. I don't want I don't want information leaking. I mean, the, em the, the emissary or a public servant, sir, it's true, but those that's, those are rumors that spread quick. I, uh, I may or may not have, uh, told a friend of mine about the baby. You what? I doubt it would ever come out. I, they, they, they called me. Oh. While we were away. And, uh, I told him about the baby. When, when did this person call you? We've been, we've been swimming in shadow stuff for so long. Oh, God, uh... uh There's a uh, moment where Marius snaps his fingers and sort of sets his hand down. In the facility. Yeah. Uh, okay. I don't know if you know this or not, but the sharp phones don't you normally get the best of reception. How did this person talk to you? Well, I don't know. It was... Through magic? <sighs> I mean, maybe. Hello, boy has been known to dabble in it. Well, damn. And he kind of like, takes a sip a little bit and say, oh, Sounds like a sending spell. I mean, your friend must be a potent caster. Yeah, they're potent. That's all. That's true. Most of the stuff they make is pretty. Ah, uh, do is pretty potent. Hmm. So why did you tell your friend about this? Well, first they thought I was lying, and uh, they asked where I've been. You, you said. You thought he was lying? Nah, at first he thought I was lying. Hmm. Yes, where, uh, where had been and all that stuff. Um, he, uh, we've been friends for a long time and he didn't. I don't know. Hey, it's, it's fine. Just fine. 
But, but I doubt he would be the type to like spread that around. Or maybe he would. Once we tell the Senate, this is going to spread either way. And right now, it looks like they might be a little more distracted than we would uh, have anticipated. Yeah, maybe so, I guess. I, uh, it slipped my mind. Uh, well, well, hold up. So, but you're saying you, you didn't contact him, though. He contacted you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With us, with uh, some sort of magic, I'm assuming sending. Why did he contact you? You don't send those kind of spells just to have a chat. Why not? Because it's potent magic. You're limited to what you can say. It's not meant for conversations. It's meant to get shit out there quick. Oh, fuck. Uh, he said he was going somewhere. Oh. Or doing something. Ah. Uh, well. It was just chatting, I promise. It ain't, it ain't nothing like. No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not coming at you. Don't worry about it. I'm just curious why he would want to contact you. I'm just yeah, wondering if there's another threat out there that we gotta worry about. Uh... So wait, what, what'd you tell him? You mentioned the oh. baby, right? Yeah. He thought I was lying, he thought it was a joke. Uh, but it was real. Um... Huh. He thinks to himself a little bit. And says... God, why can't I remember? Um, well. <laughs> he takes another sip. Uh, do you really want the answer to that? I mean, do you know? Why you can't remember? And then he'll tap the side of your mask. How many hits have you taken? She immediately gets like defensive this like shift in her like body language i mean no more than i normally take well that would be a shocker if that was the case but also your norms changed quite a bit these past few months <laughs> i mean not really jeez i'm not I'm not trying to blame you for anything okay i'm not coming at blame you blame me Blame me for what? No, no, There's no. There's nothing to blame me for. Cheats. Cheats, I'm your friend, okay? I love uh, you just the way you are, kid, okay? No, uh, yeah, yeah. I think, uh, I think I'm good. Um, I'm gonna go get some air. Or maybe some, like, I don't know. Usually on my birthday, we get mochi. I'll, I'll go get enough for everybody. Uh, and she like scoots out of the table. Um, yeah. Mm. She like rubs at like the outside of her mask where her nose would be and would walk away from the table. <sighs> Tito sits back a little bit. We'll look over at Marius. I say I say it how it is, you know. Marius, just sort of looking down at his bowl for a moment. You can see him working his jaw. He'd glance to the side, watching her leave. I don't know why he contacted her. It was better when he didn't. Who is this guy? An acquaintance. Somebody who's responsible for that drug she takes. Hmm. Bad news, huh? That's putting it mildly. Well, I'm just giving all kinds of bad news tonight. 
<laughs> I'll take another pickle shot and look over and say, Marius, if your acquaintance is capable of sending powerful magics like that that cheats on the whim, we may need more people like that. There's a <laughs> sort of pushes his bottom <laughs> jaw out and he this look of disdain that crosses his features. It's very obvious that he's mm -hmm. used to being able to just mask his expressions <laughs> behind his helmet. Yeah, he's just he sort of drinking a little, a little bit. Brings a hand up, rubs at his face. I don't know where it's at, but I can put in a call. But if nothing else, I know where his house is. The devil you know. Hey. <laughs> it just seethes for a moment. It's, uh... It's an option. Not a thing we need to do necessarily, but... It may come to it. For the good of Asmodia, yeah? <laughs> There's a head, small head turn, the brow raised purposefully as he looks at Cheadle. A very apparent look of you motherfucker on his face. Yeah, he's smirking. <laughs> yes, for the good of Asmodia. <sighs> So, <laughs> looking over at Gareth and Fania and Vizika, how are you guys enjoying the food? Why does Gagzag hate humans? <laughs> oh, it's a whole thing. You see, the, le the legends say he used to hate goblins when he was a human, but now he's a goblin who hates humans. It's it's very complex, very deep. You know, and unless you win the gold, and he just kind of goes on like that for like a few hours. Just oh my god! <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> As he talks, Vizika's like nodding, interested, wide-eyed, wide but she's like continuously slurping meats, both cooked and raw, into her mouth. She's like, mm, uh -huh, uh -huh. and like keeps like raising her arm for more, and and the bowls and plates just stack up beside her. And it just ends with. And that is why Skagzag looks after us in heaven. Wow. Well, that was a bit more than I was looking for, but thank you for telling that story. Yeah, I was a little preachy in the middle of it. I'm sorry about that. Mm. Um, Gareth's, Gareth's plate is practically untouched at this point and he hasn't really been drinking or eating anything but just kind of paying attention to everything around him more than feasting What's Vanya up? is passed out in a plate <laughs> just face Vizika. down Jesus Vizika starts reaching over and like taking meats from around her face and eating them too <laughs> she, she alright she kind of grumbles but she does not wake up It's a symptom of high, uh, high protein meals like this. Once you eat enough, your body starts to become lethargic. Uh, if you eat too much, you'll eventually start sweating. He looks at Vizika. <laughs> well, I'm going to go for a, what was it? A, a con saving throw to do with eating things. Yep. <laughs> hold up, hold up. God, if I could figure out where to do that. Constitution saving throw at advantage. Oh, oh. Um, how do I edit? Oh, uh, d uh, shift click your con or click it, your con save again. We'll just take the, the highest amount. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Uh, her, her, she, she has eaten like three times more than you think anyone of a much larger size than her could possibly eat, and still she keeps eating. 
Does Sheets ever come back after these uh, few hours? Mm -mm. Uh, yeah, I think after the couple that a couple hours that you guys stay there pass, I think um, you just kind of watch as Cheetle's just looking around. Hey, Amarius, where where Sheets gonna be? Well, if she went to go get Mochi, she should have been back, but given her demeanor, I'll probably see her in the room when we return. Right. Maybe she bought too much and can't carry it all, and we should go find her and help her. Yeah! Little guy, that's exactly what happened. <sighs> it looks down a little bit. All right, well, we should probably be heading back anyways. We've got a long, long day tomorrow. I can help look for a Marius if you wish. If you'd like. He'd, uh, he'd stand up and then he'd pull out his phone <laughs> uh, and sort of tapping across its screen for a moment. He'd uh, pull up a small little uh, small app and then he'd sort of turn it horizontal to look at it. And then give a small shake of his head. She's not back at the uh, at the hotel. Uh, you track her with that? Well, yes. Hmm. I keep track of all of my prosthetics, even the ones I don't make, or even the ones that aren't for me. So, hmm. she's at an arcade. Oh no, he's <laughs> looking around like an arcade. An arcade sounds ancient. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's uh, a place of distraction full of games. Games like sparring in a sense, sure. Hmm. Sounds interesting. Shall we go? If you would like. I can lead the way. Please do. At this point, it's the uh, evening sky. Is As you're like walking out the restaurant, it is clearly dark. The sun is out. Uh, or sorry, the, the moon is out. <laughs> and then with the glow of the city, it's just blinding you as it's just surrounded. You're used to a different type of nighttime in the Asmodian sky where things begin to get a bit dull. Uh, but now it's like a completely different landscape as you uh, leave the barbecue joint. Um, after spending some time walking across the street while looking at the life that is still happening, even, e even within the evening hours, uh, you would arrive to this, uh, this tiny little uh, side arcade by the river. Uh, stepping in, he would, uh, he would sort of give a side step to show the, uh, the, the sort of neon lit interior of the arcade, the hum of music and the, the sort of, uh, the sort of clashing sounds that resonate throughout the, uh, throughout this sort of bright room full of whatever sort of games they may have or whatever innovations may have happened and since he's been gone, um, it's probably later, so it's probably only like some older folks who are here, <laughs> some like adults. Mm -hmm. Uh no, I I would say it's 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 adults and 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 teens and yeah, it's 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 pretty Not school active. night. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, I mean, <laughs> fuck, just down. You know, you can you you can go to academia, you can download that information, or you can do whatever you need. So you'll use your credits and buy tokens specifically that you use here within the arcade and then you play games you turn back to say that and gareth is already like across <laughs> the room and there's this big arcade machine that has like a fishing rod attached to it and he's just <laughs> staring at it ah uh, yeah it's one mm. of my favorites it's uh it's why slay dragons when you could be fishing it's pretty good <laughs> mm. 
<laughs> I'm John Bone Jenkins. You can't beat my score. And his little rackling shaking. That's amazing. What? <laughs> That has to be real. Come on. That's amazing. Hey, you just oh watch my as, God. as the score of pounds starts scrolling. <laughs> a bear appears on the screen and it just says Brynjar in little gold letters. Oh. And he says, I'm a bear. And then it th goes back to another landscape. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, I spent a couple hours playing that game, but uh, I'll, I'll leave you to it. I'm going to find sheets. <laughs> just, uh, yeah, Gary. Uh. All right, he he grabs at the fishing rod, but doesn't. Nothing, nothing bad happens. <laughs> um, Did you want something bad to happen? Well, I was just leaving it to fate. All right, <laughs> um, but he he'll try shoving some credits into the machine. Is it the credits that we have? Do they yeah, work? Yeah, you can do it? that. Yeah, you okay, can just okay. you can use those credits. Yeah. He will attempt to figure out how this works. And I have, love that for him. Have fun. <laughs> it's like, hmm. All right. Uh, um, Vanya and Vizika, what are you guys doing? Dude, if there's a claw machine with like some candy. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Did anyone drag me to this place? I mean, we all yeah. went as a group, or, so unless you like. Okay, so someone woke me up. Yeah, I don't okay. think we would have left you like a yeah, like, yeah. 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 Oh my god. god I probably am suck. sat down in a corner, kind of just trying to digest a little bit, mm -hmm. uh, having a hard time. A few buttons of my coat are open, you know, just, mm -hmm. yeah. You're, you're it's, looking it's around, wondering where the next plate of meat is. <laughs> not really, not really. Not thinking about more food right now, just... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, trying to hold it all in. I want to do a check for how good at the claw machine do it. is. <laughs> the candy claw machine. What kind of roll would that be? Mm, I'd say dexterity. That's pretty good. All right. She just, uh, she stays winning. She, she stays there for a very long time and ends up with like two massive, like she has to, have her arms together crossed across her chest to like hold all the candy that she has. She's like holding her shirt out to hold it all. And she like brings some of it over to Vanya. Hey, hey, hey. Mm -hmm, I yes, some yes. Some candy what? for you. What? Have some candy. Uh, I don't think I should eat more, but. That's a good uh, idea. What? What? He gives her some chocolate wrapped up. Try it. Have I ever had chocolate? before probably not hmm uh oh i'm what is so it? excited for that i don't it, it, trust me it's gonna be so good you're gonna love it you're okay love so it. <laughs> all right i i will start trying to take a bite with the cover like well, still well, with no, the no, wrapper no, 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 no. And, and look 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 yeah you have to unwrap it you have to take it out you got, you got the it out wrapping of... already in your mouth spit, spit, it, spit it out she okay. holds out her hand spit it out Okay, here. There's a laugh from halfway across the arcade. <laughs> the irony is not lost on her. She 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 was very much mimicking Marius's tone of voice. Yeah. Like, Get it out. <laughs> uh, yeah, she unwraps right it and hands it back to Vanya. It's just it's just a oh, slightly it's it's a not as high pitched voice. Spit it out. <laughs> I love so, her circles. I I look at it and. Uh, V Vizika, trust me. Are you trying? Are you trying to trick me? This looks like no. This looks like feces, Vizika. She's gonna put it on her leg and then unwrap. Like she's gonna dump all the candy that she has on the floor, plop down, and start like frantically unwrapping her own and shoves like four in her mouth. Vizika, if you're trying to make me eat poop, I swear to God, <gasps> this is not like poop. I swear to God. No! <laughs> a couple like circle gives you wide berth circle like oh. <laughs> 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 oh, said... oh good heavens <laughs> oh my god <laughs> I will I will uh, kind of you know with my the, the, the tip of my tongue just took lick it's it a little bit lick it's like a little bit 
just to see if it's poop or not. It's like a Kit Kat. <laughs> That's what she gave you. What what did she give me? Like a poop. like a Kit Kat. She gave you poop. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> she tricked you. She tricked you the whole time. It's poop. Shit. <laughs> no, Wait, it's not do poop. I roll? Do no, I roll? No, I'm see what she no. got. She sticker. won candy from the candy claw okay, machine. Okay, okay, okay. What if it, there's poop in there? No. <laughs> Please be out of business. So okay, so I, I take a little lick, and my my eyes will go real wide. Like, what? A, what is this? This flavor? It's chocolate. It's chocolate. It's chocolate. Is it magical? Yeah. What does it do? It tastes good. <laughs> good enough. <laughs> I'll just put it all in my mouth. I just start... <clears throat> so you got more of this. Vizika slides like half of her pile over to Vanya. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, well, uh, that's what Vanya is going to be doing for the rest of uh, the hour. Just going <laughs> through this chocolate, I guess. All right. Like two kids after Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Cheats, what are you doing? Uh, she is at the very DDR-esque mm -hmm. game uh, section. She is fucking it up. Mm -hmm. Just anger dancing. <laughs> uh, the, uh, the dodge, the dodge dash machine? What? Well. Yeah, the, the, <laughs> the dodge dash machine allows you to... It's a movement-based uh, thing. Oh yeah, dodge dash, of course. <laughs> I guess uh, that's what Marius would where where Marius would find her. That's where he headed first. Yeah. He'd uh, sort of take a couple steps and then sort of stop, just hearing the the sort of pounding of her feet on the. Uh, on the sort of metallic surface. And he'd shift and wait until there was a lull. Cheating again, are we? <laughs> no. No. You know what's not fair. <sighs> Why wouldn't it be fair? I mean, everyone else gets to dance on them. That'd be like me using the strength machine and punching it with this. He holds up his prosthetic. What'd you put for your name this time? <laughs> she just looks at the board and like every single uh every single high score is a uh, zero uh eight zero zero eight. <laughs> Clever. Nothing. Did you come to collect me? No. Whatever. I came for Mochi. <clears throat> well, they have a great... They have great Mochi here, so I'm, sh I'm sure you'll enjoy it. He looks around. He'd eventually sort of approach, sort of just you, uh, sort of placing a hand on that uh, bar, or the railing that's there at the back of these machines. You know, he didn't mean anything by it, right? She swipes her credit, <laughs> the little card chip again on the machine. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> I mean, I I understand. I mean, it's not like I'm not oblivious to it all.
when we get back to the hotel tonight, I have something I want to show you. <sighs> yeah, all right. Yeah. I don't. I don't want to see it unless uh, unless you beat my high school. Oh my! He. She kind of like she she offers this grin and like the the corners of the mask go as like they go upward. There's a fall of the shoulders. The least dexterous person in the party. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I mean, it's fine. <laughs> He'd uh, sort of round the machine. She like makes up a remark. Bet you wish you brought your arm now, huh, big man? She steps off of it. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Always hated these games. Hmm. Uh, uh -oh. We're gonna cheat. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I hack into the machine. <laughs> nope. Uh, I mean, I could. That would be funny. Yeah. Um, we're going to uh, we're going to do Cat's Grace. Okay. The uh, the lights on his prosthetics hum. The there's the small light from the crystal in his forehead. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And uh, we're gonna try and dance, or try to try to beat the rhythm game. All right, let's see how you do. <laughs> Ooh! Oh, that was almost a zero. <laughs> wow! Almost, oh, almost, goodness. almost broke the Jeez. machine. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> hey, I got an eight decks, by the way. <laughs> oh boy! Oh. Holy shit. It is. There is no rhythm. He's got uh, two left feet. Uh, his prosthetic might as well be on backwards. Uh, it is uh, It is a... To anybody even slightly proficient at the game, it a child could probably do better. <laughs> so uh, not getting that high score. Absolutely not. <laughs> Ooh, just a couple hundred short. That Ugh. just a couple. He'd <laughs> roll his jaw and then sort of. How much does this game cost? <laughs> <laughs> this is probably oh, one of the more expensive. One of the more expensive ones. So this is like uh, that one's probably like five credits. Oh. <laughs> Breaking the bank. <laughs> Last game. And then he'd <laughs> swipe his credits again. And try one more time. Dodge, dodge, dash. Oh, my goodness. Yes, sir. <laughs> not, uh, not even any better. <laughs> Ooh, gosh. You, you're getting old. That's crazy. You're getting... <laughs> <laughs> she just grins, and finally there's, like, this air of, like, smile that comes back. <laughs> there's some part of his brain that's, like, just hack him. Just hack it, idiot. <laughs> but he stops. He, uh, he gave it the old college try and sort of... It takes a very heavy step off of the machine. It lifts several inches. And he'd shake yeah, his head. Tried. Well, looks like I'll keep my gift to myself then. <laughs> uh, wait a minute, what? <laughs> no, no, it's fine. I'll probably give it to Bazika. She'd eat it anyway. <laughs> <coughs> gift? No, no, it's fine. Oh, come on. It's not my fault you didn't beat the high school. How were you supposed to? Mm. Well, cheat. if you'd like to see it, regardless <laughs> of me having beat the high score or not, which I could easily do, by the way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Of course. 
It'll be in the room. So. But I think the others, uh, they might be breaking the, the games. So. Oh, <laughs> shit. You. <laughs> everybody. About came. everybody? Well, they were all worried about you. They are your friends after all. What's Cheadle doing at the arcade? Uh, Cheadle right now is right behind, uh, <laughs> right oh, okay. behind Gareth while oh, nice. he's, he, he's, <laughs> while he's played. Yeah. Gareth's been on like the scrolling attract screen the whole time and he yeah. doesn't understand to like press start or anything. So yeah. he's just like, I, I don't understand that this camera doesn't even show me what I'm trying to fish. You, you gotta press the button up there. You gotta press the button. What is a button? What, you got to press where the, is it? The press the no, it's so he he climbs up the machine. You gotta press the button like a small child, like full palm, presses the button. Uh, He's definitely drunk on pickle shots. Garrett, you gotta press the button. Where where's the button? It's right here. He's like he's now stepping on the button because he's standing <laughs> on the thing. It's right here, right there. Oh, okay. Well now, then what? You put the credits in. Move! I can't even see the screen. No, get, it's get so, down from uh, there. Oh, oh, he's climbing down, Gareth. No, oh. it's over here. You gotta do it right over. He's <laughs> pointing at the. <laughs> God, what's the uh, <laughs> what's the alcohol content in those pickle shots? Jesus, yeah, put the carrot. No, <laughs> the carrot. No yeah. How much? The carrot. I don't know the wish I. The credit. No, the credit. The credit. I didn't say credit. carrot. What? I put my money in the machine already. <laughs> well, how did you do that? What are you? You, it you just knew how to, fit, you, so I shoved it in there. You knew how to do that? You're, you're, you're picking it up so fast there, kid. You're doing good. Thank, thank you. How much money did you put in? Uh, five All credits. <laughs> five what? Uh, five credits? I don't know. It did. <laughs> he looks up at the screen. Uh, he squints. How many times did you press the chip next to the thing? What? The ch I, you pressed it. You stood on the. No, no, no. How many? The, the credits. The yeah, how many? How often? How many credit? How many times you put credits in there? Five times. What? Yeah, no. You, you think you were buying 10 credits a pop, which were five. You just bought that five times, which means you spent 250. Well, I just want to play game. the game at this point. I don't. You're going to play a lot of it, buddy. Good. You're going to play a lot of it. Good. This. And this is. Won't. This is stuck to the machine. I don't understand. No, no, you press the button. Look, okay, come here. No, let me just, he presses the button a few times. It adds like, it adds like three lives to it. Look, here, you play. I'll no, watch no. how it's done. No, no, it's good. Now, now hold no. the rod. I don't want to hold the rod. It's going to pick your character. Hold the rod. This is... Cast it. Cast it in the screen. Y'all very unenthusiastically just like tilt the rod forward and pull it back it'll say uh after you do that it goes up like a couple of points and it goes weak and then it says <laughs> it pulls up your character and it's an old wizard man named esmer no <laughs> oh my god <laughs> yes <laughs> <laughs> oh you got esmer he doesn't catch anything in this game but <laughs> He's a dredger, you know. <laughs> Gareth, like, actually forcefully rips the fishing rod off and just throws oh. it on the ground. Walks away. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, everyone, we gotta go. <laughs> it's like they're running away from because the machine literally violently, psh, psh, like, sparking out of oh, the machine. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> we should Marius, go. Marius wouldn't run. <laughs> We should probably go. He'd fix it so that way they don't get in trouble. <laughs> so after uh, an evening at the arcade, would you return back to the, the room? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's not a trick question. <laughs> no. DM, why are we an initiative? <laughs> Just your dice rolling. <laughs> All right, one second. Uh, yeah, so uh, once you all get back to the uh, the hotel, 
uh, you're going to see it is very dark because uh, currently like, it's currently uh, oh yeah it's almost 11 o'clock at night mm-hmm. Ugh. I think I had too much to drink <laughs> hey what, what uh, hey hey <laughs> looks like yeah. che- cheats hey and we I'm, 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 I'm sorry all right she stops him in the room. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's like geez. a like a palm on top of the head and goes <laughs> and pushes us in the room. I hope she knows I'm sorry. <laughs> Gareth. Hmm? Do you think she knows I'm sorry? Where where are you? I'm in the You're room, in Gareth. <laughs> I'm in I'm in our room. Don't forget to close your door. Good night, Ito. Oh, oh. oh I'm sorry. sorry. Uh, Who are you? You're sorry to me. I'm sorry to everybody. <laughs> Sleep well, you two. No, I don't want any candy. Thank you, though. Oh, okay. And then he passes out. Oh, for me. <laughs> yeah. We can get room service too. We can eat more. Here, come in. I'll close. Okay, close the door. Close the door. Close the door. We can. <laughs> We could, we could get room service. Do you want to get room service? I just think this is a good idea, Vizika. I'll be honest with you. I... Uh, mm, uh, mm. Is there a bathroom in here? Yeah. yeah it's, it's over here. Door. Okay, okay, okay. I'll yeah. just... Uh, <laughs> um, oh my yeah, it's violent. It's violent. No, no. Um, oh. Right. Uh, oh no! She as she is puking, she's holding a hand up, like with a finger up, just kind of like to sig to signal. Wait, don't just wait until it's done. <laughs> okay, Zika <clears throat> to herself. She's probably gonna be hungry after that. And she like oh, goes yeah, to I, up um, room service. <laughs> yeah, I have so much space now. Good call. Good call. <laughs> <laughs> You order everything on the menu. Yes. <laughs> Several bur- yes. burgers, salads, fries, many pizzas. Yes. <laughs> Two tro- of every dessert. And a trope and taco <laughs> special. Yes. <laughs> the alabaster pork. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, the Senate's gonna be so fucking mad. <laughs> we hey. will not give them the receipt until later. Hey, you guys, spend a little extra. <laughs> okay. Okay. Seven hundred credit a charge. Bit. <laughs> she uh, she wouldn't get anything on the menu that's like the hella luxury, super expensive stuff, right? Because she, even even she knows what money is, but she would get. She would absolutely get one of everything that's like reasonably priced. Okay. As you're like pawing through this digital menu, like looking at all the different types of meals you can get here, you're like, oh, I'll get this, I'll get this, I'll get this, I'll get this. Oh, that sounds good. good. Oh, Mm -hmm. that looks good. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to try that. Uh, After about a few minutes of doing that, you realize that the menu that you have is not just room service that's cooked in house, but it's room service of other food outside of the hotel. Delivered to your room. Oh, Her oh, eyes widen, dash. and she's like, "Oh no, half these places are probably going to be closed." And then she she looks at how big the book is, all, and then she quickly goes back and like deletes everything that isn't from like in house. <laughs> I love it. There's gonna be a lot of spit in your food. You're lucky you did that. <laughs> wow. A real Garrett, that, that's a real Garrett. That's a real Marius thing to do there, uh, Vizika. She, she, even she has her limits. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> even she's not a botster. Um, Marius and Cheats, what are you guys doing? There was a uh, two questions that I had asked you um, during our last session mm. that you had said you were going to ponder. Ah, yes. So, um, the answer is yes. It is It is uh, definitely possible. However, um, it is a project that's going to take quite some time. What this means is there will be a tier system 
that you can build into to continuously improve upon the drug um, that Cheats uses. However, because of how potent and the chemical that actually is used the drug, um, it would be like a, incredibly like we're talking like lifelong continue to study uh, difficult to actually get rid of all the side effects. So there are two routes that you can take. Um, well, actually, technically there's three, but I know there's only two. One of the two you're going to choose. You can either start amplifying the effects of the hasted action itself um, while still taking in the same impact. So essentially raising the potency without raising the consequence to make the drug even stronger without the uh, the kickback that it has. So it, make it makes it more uh, more potent, more impactful. Or you can begin to dull the effects of the um, like tame the effects of the kickback of the radiation kickback which will also take time while still maintaining its current potency okay but that would be your option those, those would be like the two paths you can go down okay I think I think ultimately Marius's intent is to get rid of the the addictive quality of the chemical. Yeah. Um and lessen the harm done to her body. So 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 essentially keep it it keep it potent um but lower those effects. And Indeed. also but also com once you finally completely delude those effects it's also going to dilute the effect of the the mask as well. It's still going to have a little bit of potency, but it'll start diluting that as well to like completely remove that. The hope is to wean her off of it until she eventually doesn't need it anymore. Yep, that's it. Um, and for the leg. Yes. What was the question about that? I apologize. If I could improve using the parts that we had left over, Mm -hmm. Um, if I could improve her, uh, sort of weaker prosthetic that she has. To, to like, to, to make it do more essentially either, uh, it's either a, it's a, it's an aesthetic change. So that way she's matching, mm -hmm. uh, or B if it's possible to increase her movement speed. So yeah, you can, you can change, uh, the pros prosthetic and, uh, yes, you can actually improve the movement speed of the legs by 10 feet. How much would that have costed me? Let me, let me check real quick. Mm -mm -mm. One moment, please. I want to say it's it would only be 400 to do that. He'd absolutely yeah. <laughs> have spent 400, 400 of the uh, the material to uh, to basically have made this leg. Mm -hmm. But let me let me see real quick. Of course, It'd be like some boots. Yeah, I would say, excuse me. Yeah, I would say uh, 400 for the leg improvement. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. uh, he would sort of going into his armor, um, he would sort of pat the bed over here and wait for her to move. She's like scrolling on her phone. <laughs> hey. Huh? Over here. Oh, no, you're fine. I can take the couch. <laughs> Over here, please. She, like, dramatically slaps her <laughs> phone back into her pocket. You know, 
like a like a like a kid. <laughs> he uh, sits on the bed, sort of reaching into this uh, the the massive suit of armor that's there. He'd his hand moves along uh, the sort of intricate patterns that make the interior, and uh, his uh, the sort of leg that's standing there would hum, and he would pull from it this uh, sort of vibrant, uh, sort of uh, bright red leg. Um, it has its uh, very sort of articulated joints that make it up with uh, small streaking lights that run up the length of it, that uh, when he holds it, they almost give off that small hum. The effect is that when you run, it leaves behind light trails. Ooh. And he would turn, sort of holding both of them. So, you've had that beat up prosthetic for a while. And since my armor improvements, I have been working on this on the side. And before we got here, I was able to finish it. I know it's a little late, but happy birthday. Wow. That's for me. That, Go on. They can Let's get that other one off. She kind of like scrambles backward and like starts pulling off the like many padded uh, straps she hooks to her belt to like kind of put between um, like her skin and uh, the prosthetic itself. Yeah, yeah. Uh... Oh shit! <laughs> once she's once she's removed the prosthetic, he would move. Uh sort of shifting on a heel and then move to kneel down. And he would uh, very gently sort of latch the new prosthetic into place, sort of giving it this loud turn until it clicks and it hisses the entire thing now activating the, the <sighs> joints and everything sort of compressing and then relaxing. Ugh. <sighs> it's always like a real uncomfortable hug for... So, there are two parts to this. Uh, now that we've replaced your old, older prosthetic, you should feel some more freedom of movement as you travel about. You'll be a lot lighter. The other thing is that I've also imbued them. It's a temporary thing. If I need to change it later on, the enhancement will fail. But for right now, you should be able to move quietly. Wow, I am. Um... I don't know what to say. I never really know what to say when you, when you do this stuff. Do you like it? Do I like it? I mean... I... I it, yeah, I like it? What do you mean? Look at it! She, like, like bends... Uh, like her right foot or her left foot's like upward and then looks at the left one and she goes is it supposed to move i'm just kidding i'm just kidding and she like starts moving it <laughs> well if you like it then that's all you have to say and i'm I match now you do i ain't never matched before i'm sorry it took so long I never expected it. You know I can't pay for something like this. I never expected you to pay. Go, go on. <laughs> Give him a try. She like looks at him. <laughs> looks at the legs. Looks at him again. And stands up. They, uh, 
You can definitely tell that they calibrate for a moment, sort of adjusting to the weight, and then they eventually relax and uh, sort of uh, conform to your movement style. And uh, I don't remember if I gave it to you last episode or if it would be this episode, but it would be I've I've taken the rep I've used the replicate magic item infusion uh, to make basically your legs boots of elven kind. Wow. So while you are, while you have your legs basically until I need to change out the infusion, um, regardless of the surface that you are moving across, you make no sound. Um, and you have advantage on dexterity stealth checks that require, uh, that rely on you moving silently. So your movement speed, uh, at Brett's approval, would have increased, and mm -hmm. you now don't make any sound when you walk. Oh. Yeah, I think she'd take a few steps. Kind of just... forward. And whereas, like, before, there had been those, like, sounds every time she stepped, there was just... silent. She almost looks back... Adam, like, <gasps> did you hear that? <laughs> it took a bit of uh, a bit of testing, which I had to do with my own armor. But both your legs now should allow you to move quietly, regardless of where you are. Stepping on broken glass, stepping on metal plating, stepping out on the road or on gravel. Nobody will hear you coming. <laughs> you and she will reach to basically hug him very like gruffly <laughs> like a oof kind of hug uh there's that moment of hesitation arms out to the side uh before eventually reciprocating the hug i'm glad you like them <laughs> So, uh, let's see here. Uh, hey, Gareth, what are you doing? Uh, Gareth would be kind of thinking about the last thing Cheadle said before he passed out. Um, how he's sorry for everything. And he's got a really somber kind of expression on his face as he removes his armor, places it in the armor holder. <laughs> he's going to take a smaller towel and dip it in the toilet. And he's gonna, he's gonna come out and place it gently on Cheadle's head, <laughs> forehead. Oh, that's, oh, that, that's nice. Thank you. <laughs> and, then, uh, <laughs> and then he'll take the the comforter from his bed and and place it over Cheadle, and climb into bed himself, sword kind of propped up next to the bed within reach. It smells like eggs. I'll just uh, assume that's some drunken rambling. <laughs> and then uh, you're going to sleep as well? Yeah. All right. God, I love Gareth so much. <laughs> Holy fuck. I love Gareth so much, dude. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> so you guys would take a long rest until the next uh, until the next uh, until the next morning as you guys get up like um, Cheadle is ready to go because you guys have a very early appointment and he's uh, you know he's trying to get everything going Get get getting everything trying to work out. Um, are you all able to get ready uh, pretty quickly? Do you feel, or what? What do you um like? What's your what's the morning ritual feel like? I think, 
I don't know about Vanya, but I think uh, Vizika and Vanya would have like eaten enough food and drank enough non-alcoholic things <laughs> to wake up not too hungover. Like, yeah. probably still very full, like painfully <laughs> full from the night before. Um, but but like they would have had in more than enough electrolytes and like salt and potassium and everything to like feel pretty good waking up. Hey, Vanya, Vizika, you guys, you guys up? And then you just hear like plate shattering out, out in the front of your room. <laughs> What the f <laughs> What is all this? <laughs> what? 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 Did you have a buffet? <laughs> yeah. Was that an option? I guess it was. <laughs> I mean, you you said it, buddy. We can just have room service, and yep. so we did. Um, and so we did. Yeah. You know, have you have you ever had that thing? They call it chocolate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, oh. Every once in a while, yeah. Uh, well, it was my first time yesterday. Oh, that's exciting. It was. Nice. It really Jeez. was. That's really good. Uh. <laughs> we, we gotta meet the sun. <laughs> you say uh, we're going to the sun? No, we're going to see the Senate. Oh, Chiro. Why do you smell like eggs? I, to my face, hell no, like, he wipes his head. <laughs> when I woke up, my forehead was very damp and smelt like eggs. Uh, <laughs> oh, nice perfume. Um, that's uh, a weird hotel, right? Yeah. Come on, guys! <laughs> Marius sort of crawls back into his armor. Loud mechanical <laughs> hum before it all clicks back into place. She just like bumping into things because she's like walking a little too fast. She like walks over <laughs> to like ah ah. Uh. She like bumps into the table, grabs See. her uh, whip and stuff, gets her gear. Uh, so. uh. Yeah, no, I know, I know, I know. That's just. Um, I'm used to them. To, yeah, <laughs> I don't know if I ever told you this, but you know, yeah, the other one was about an inch shorter. Hey! Uh, hey! Looks like oh, oh, look at those points at the legs. And she does a pose, like a fashion pose. That looks as good. She steps out. That looks good. That looks real good. That's really gonna win over the Senate. We gotta go. Hey! 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 <laughs> All right. So uh, you guys would leave the hotel as um. <clears throat> as Cheadle seems to be in a very like rushed movement, like we we gotta we gotta go, we gotta get this this done sort of thing. And uh and yeah, you guys would walk over across the map. Actually, let me show you where you'd be. Uh huh. You guys would cross over mm -hmm. to the uh center. Of Io, the Ionian Spire, where the uh, Ionian Ooh. Senate resides. Fancy. It's about to get fancy as you walk into um, what I can only describe as this, like, this, this beautiful building. One moment. One moment. Uh... Ready to get angry? Uh. Oh no. Ooh. You would walk into probably the cleanest building you've ever been in. Whoa. And he just. Hello. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Immediately beelines it to the nearest NPC. Hello. Step aside. I'm Zika. What's your name? Step aside, citizen. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yeah, they're not really meant for talking. Hello. <laughs> Pardon us. <laughs> Coming through it. I meant to be here. Nice to meet you. Um, uh, Vanya uh, and Marius, you start to feel like 
you start to get a, 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 a stinging pain in your head for a brief moment, then turns into a, a headache. <clears throat> he sort of, grew, like a hand comes up to the side of the helmet. Oh. Didn't even say anything yet. And uh, you'll watch as Cheetah's looking around. He looks behind you guys and see, and Vanya, you also feel this as well. Everything all right? Oh, of my head is pounding. I oh uh, oh jeez, I totally forgot to tell you. Uh, the he points over to these things, and he goes, "It's uh ah jeez, it's a uh, magical suppression. Specifically, if your dietic energies are not attuned to the actual area, it suppresses your spellcasting ability." And I forgot to tell you, because it's a bit of a bitch when you feel it for the first time. Marius goes to tap a panel on his armor, and it produces one of those vials, and he looks, and the uh, the chemical mixture inside is completely diluted. It's, it's useless, and he sort of grimaces and shoves it back into the panel. Bureaucracy. Well, it's going to get a little worse. I'm assuming Not you all... Uh, Brought your weapons, right? <laughs> Marius, his hammer on his back. No. <laughs> <laughs> we, we gotta, we gotta check him in. And you watch as he pulls out the daggers. Um, as the security guard looks down at the screen. The pistols too. I was getting to that. Jeez. Yeah, no use hiding. They pretty much know uh, everything that's happening in this room. And then he pulls out his two pistols and puts them down. I think they can, like, see under our clothes and shit. She, like, covers her body. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking freaks. Hey, 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 hey don't be looking at it. Placing <laughs> her, her stuff on mm -hmm. the desk kind of comically because it's a lot of pistols and guns. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just like <laughs> piling him on, just like just that, just, yeah. She doesn't really care too much about the guard, just does it, like, is that, is that all? Is that fine? The poisons as well. This is it. <laughs> just mm, take care of them, okay? They'll be taken care of, no worries. Um, mm. and so you, you, you surrender all your, your weapons and anything that can deal damage, correct? Right. Okay. Next. Zika's gonna walk up using her, her quarterstaff as a walking stick. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> and just Marius, stand beside Vanya. Yep. Marius reaches back, grabbing the, uh, the sort of collapsed head of the ignition hammer, and he would set it down this... This bulky hammer head with uh, uh, that sort of like rattles when he places it. And then the guard looks at you even further. What? We can take care of the suit. <laughs> is that entirely necessary? At these times, it is. We will take good care of the suit. If you need some privacy, there's a bathroom right around the corner. He'd almost like being indignant would the back panel pops and he'd crawl out of the armor. <laughs> Is this like piano music playing in the lobby? Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Oh my God, she's, she's, she's dragging the wick of Marius. No! <laughs> <laughs> the husk of Marius. <laughs> Next. Uh oh. 
But Gareth will step forward and like accidentally shoulder the crystal here. Whoops. Whoops. Whoopsies. He'll place his maul, his twin blade, his crossbow, his demise of rebellion. Um, one shield. The crossbow bolt, okay. please. He's unhappy, but he follows the uh, the request. Also, the volatile vials. Probably filled with explosives of some kind. Yes. Mm. We would also like to ask you to remove the crowbar, the hammer, and the ten pythons that you have in your back pocket. Oh, you need our pythons? Uh, Vizuka takes hers out of her pockets and spills them all over the counter. <laughs> Falling pipe dot wave. Oh, and hammers and crowbars, too. I'm <laughs> so much lighter. Next. Uh, Cheats will sashay. Uh, her whip is currently attached at her, like, lower back. Yeah. Uh, like a tail. Mm -hmm. it very much matches her entire aesthetic. And she will step up and... Pull the cheat code out, um, kind of like looking at it and sadly putting it on the <laughs> counter. Mm -hmm. The short sword she has as well. It's just coming out of nowhere. Mm -hmm. And the short bow and the other dagger that she has. And the arrows that she has. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she kind of pulls out like her hammer, her crowbar, yep. everything. <laughs> Can I keep this? And she like rings the bell. <laughs> That is sufficient. Oh, yay. She just keeps, she brings it a few more times and puts it away. <laughs> <laughs> and I you gave, um, you said you gave the, the whip? Uh, it's attached at her back like a tail. Ah, uh, okay. Um, uh, the guard will look over and look to you and then. Oh, I also have this. Hold on. And she pulls out a candle. It could be very dangerous. Uh, and then he looks at your legs specifically and then looks up at you and says, We understand that that may be necessary for you to be mobilized. Uh, we won't request uh, you, you, the, the metal legs that you have attached. However, we do ask that you wear this bracelet while you are uh, within this building. Uh, what's it do? It's a physical suppressant, so any swift movements will keep you limited. AKA, any uh, offensive actions that you take are at made a disadvantage. Uh, there's like this, uh, like this just briefest flash of like, almost like a thousand yard chromatic stare that's in her eye, and then she just shakes her head. Yeah. Um, her hand reaches up and scratches at the base of her mechanical ear. Of course. Uh, of course. She holds out her wrist. Um, it'll attach to you, and it feels like, like it squeezes your wrist a little bit at first, and then it kind of releases a little bit, uh, and the bracelet is in effect. Ugh. We thank you for your cooperation. We'll remove it when you are done with your meeting. Yeah. She like walks away looking at her wrist, like rubbing her thumb over the bracelet. All right, guys. You, uh, you doing okay? Yep. Okay. Sure. All right. Well, uh, the meeting rooms down this hall, they're expecting us. Zika walks using her cane as an old person would, uh, <laughs> using her, uh, her quarter staff. <laughs> Is your leg okay? Oh, uh, you know, just the usual. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> God, bitch. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> All right, one second.
Now, louding. You guys don't mind if we go a little over today, right? Um, my mom's going to be here in like five minutes. <laughs> you guys don't mind if we go for like in five minutes, right? Oh, that's fine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. You know, Miss Mom shows up. Hey, you done? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you guys kind of like walk over to this hall, um, and there you enter this like open room a little bit, and uh, yeah, you'll kind of see that there's a, a a panel over here, and Cheetle's just gonna like walk past you guys. And just be like, all right, uh, all right, just uh, you're probably gonna want to stand in the center of the room. They gotta, uh, they gotta uplink our image over to the Senate Hall. Do what? I went back in my helmet. Let's fucking go. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it! Your token was there. Hold on one second. Hold on. <laughs> all right, I'm ready. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. One second. Project okay. this. Ooh, I bless. did not mean to click that. Lamal. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag blessed. Hashtag blessed. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Give me one second. Okay. Oh, there we go. All right. Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, How about we need a poor nano uh, music? Oh. Hey, yeah, yeah. No, it's okay, everyone. Just, uh, they're gonna upload our images over to where, to the Senate Hall, and we're all gonna see them through here. It's gonna project a little. Uh, it's gonna project an area. You'll see. Wait, if it's They're not even gonna then, be in here, then why do they need to take everything? Yeah, they're a little cautious. All right, one second, please. Uh, and then you'll kind of watch as uh, Cheetah will press some buttons a little bit and beep. Beep, 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 beep. And then, uh, and then, yeah, give me one second. I have to get the map just right. I don't like this. You feel like I'm in a fucking jail? Uh, and then you're going to wa watch as the walls kind of open up. Um, and it looks like a giant room just sort of comes out, uh, before you. And, um, you then you realize it's actually like an illusion of you being being there uh, as it just and you just see um, yeah you just it opens up to this rather large hall oh wow <gasps> well, I mean. and uh, before you you see uh, all of the entire Ionian uh, Senate. Uh, this man will will stand up, and you'll see here sort of echo from a speaker, or from like like a like up from the ceiling, just as uh, to announce the position. Is Senator Kern from Kathos District One, Speaker of the Senate? Ah. Uh, Welcome, uh, hunters of Asmodia. Uh, it is a pleasure to see you here. What news of the other side of the Sea of Stars? And that is where uh, we will stop for now. Because <laughs> we're wrapping up with, uh, with uh, Into the Shadows Breach. Thank you so much for playing. Yo! Thanks for running. Sweet. This is a dope ass map. That's so cool. Much. I've loved everything since we touched down. Every map, every music, <laughs> everything. It's so yeah. cool. All right. Well, guys, we'll be back uh, next week. Does that sound good with you all? Yep. All please, right. Pretty please. Oh, I'll, I'll see you guys <laughs> next week then. Thank bye you bye. So much. Bye. 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 bye.